hello, hello everybody, hello Logical, and hello Red, how you guys will do, and today I hope you had a lovely weekend. I am here for this song that's playing right now. Just saying. I freaking love this song. The classical version, and then it's spoopified. Oh, it's so amazing. I almost was going to wait for the song to finish playing before... I turned my mic on because I love it so much. <laughs> Boo! I scared the shit out of you, sorry. <laughs> it is spoopy month, that's what it's all about. I can be a very scary person sometimes. I can scare people. <laughs> but I am sorry. How are you doing? Top over to the screen. I had the volume up because the music was low and you just talked. <laughs> been there, been there, done that, yes. <laughs> Yeah, I have the music lower just because I don't want to adjust it from scene to scene to scene. So yeah, it is a bit lower. But I do that all the time. I do that all the time. I'll be on someone's stream and I'll have it like jacked up to hear either their music or I've been on a previous stream and that person was a little bit lower and I pop over to another stream and oh my god, it just scares the hell out of me. Give me at least a nine hour warning. Okay, I will I will put that on my calendar and I'll give you a nine hour warning next time that I pop on just to make sure that I don't scare you again. I promise. <laughs> How has everybody been though? I hope you all have a lovely weekend. And like I said, I'm here for this music. I think it's over. No. No, the song is over. I freaking love that song. Oh well. This is the spoopy station on Pretzel Rocks. I'm hoping they keep it as the free version for the entire month of October. Cause I'm so here for it. You're here for the shirt day? Yes, it is October. It is officially spoopy season. I mean, I know I've had my decorations on my stream for the last two weeks because I put them up early because, you know, I love everything Halloween, so I put them up early. But from here on out, I will be wearing all my Halloween style outfits um, because I freaking... Love them, and I don't wear them all the time just so that they make them more special for for the Halloween season. And they are all free. I found them all free on Booth if anybody is a VTuber and wants to check them out. Normally, if I can remember, if I don't get too busy after stream, I post a link on my Twitter um, to give credit to the creator of the outfit. Um, sometimes I promise I try and not to, but I do forget sometimes after stream because I get busy or sidetracked in my brain goes off in a different direction sometimes and I totally forget everything I'm doing. That's pet fair. How you feeling today? I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. I'm doing good. I had a nice weekend, kind of relaxed, chilled. They didn't do a lot. I played some games on Saturday and then yesterday I hung out in a lot of streams. And I'm ready for stream today. Um... I said on Friday we might play maybe some Disney Dreamlight um, during DBD days because we play DBD on Mondays and Wednesdays. And since this month, I'm going to try and squeak in more horror games on Friday Fridays. Um, I don't think we'll play Disney very much. So either that's just going to take a back burner or we'll play it on DBD days after like, you know, midway through stream, but I don't know. I, I don't really feel like playing it today, but I'm going to kind of judge the fog. There are some days where in the fog, it just seems not quite as fun as other days. And so um, I'm just going to kind of judge that and we'll play Disney if I feel like it. If not, we might put Disney on the back burner until at least November or just days where the fog doesn't feel very, fog doesn't feel very friendly, which doesn't happen often, but it does. It does happen. It does. Love that for you. Love that. Save me too. Uh, the fog speaks to you today? I hope so. I hope so. Because I'm really in the mood to play DVD today. And again, like I said, you never know. You never know. Some days you just get those days in the fog where it's just a little extra spicy. Is the way I like to say it. But in the end, you know, I always try and remember it's a video game. If people are going to play a certain way, go for it. Go for it. You know, we may not always agree on each other's play styles. You know, no one in particular, just in general. But, you know, sometimes it just gets to you a little bit more than usual. So that is the plan right now. DBD for as long as we can or until something happens and I get frustrated. Then we'll switch to Disney, but it doesn't happen often, so. 
To, honestly, DVD is starting to feel unfun, so I moved back to playing different games. Understandable. Understandable, because I have days like that in the fog. That's why I try to only main it two days a week. It's so that that doesn't happen to me, because I'm afraid that one day I'm just going to wake up and be like, I don't want to play DBE. And I have, I used to be a variety streamer, so I know I could always go back to that, but I totally get it. I totally get it. I mean, is it that it's two days a week and the rest of the week is random games? Yes! See, that's what I do. I have it as two days a week. I have it on Monday and Wednesdays. Friday is my variety day, and then I'm off all the other days because either I am doing stuff offline because I'm, I got stuff to take care of, or um, even if I didn't play, or if I had an extra day, like, I've thought about adding random Saturday streams, but not yet because I'm not sure. Um, it would be a it would be a variety game for sure. I'd only stick to DVD two days a week because I think if I put any more, I I wouldn't say I would think I would start to be unfun or bore me or whatever the case may be. But I I would have the feeling of it might get to be too much. So I completely understand. I don't know what kind of fog we're talking about because my brain is always full of fog. Same. My brain is always full of fog. It, it always be that way. Not nah, be toxic. People suck. <laughs> Hello, Magic. How are you doing? See, that's what I try to do in the fog. It not be toxic, but I try to make the game fun for everybody. I mean, okay, I will admit, I will admit, when someone pisses me off in the fog, I will take it out on them. There was a game recently where I think it was a newer Meg. And she wasn't going for saves, and the other two people, and I was Survivor, the other two people gave up, and this girl wasn't going for saves. She was just stand, Hello, sitting on a gen, and as soon as the killer caught her, I left her. I was like, girl, you're staying there on that hook, and I'm going for hatch. Now, that's not fun for her, of course, but at the same time, I'm just like, screw you. <laughs> I want to get hatch. So, you know, there are days where I feel like I you gotta throw some toxicity out there just for funsies, but it's never meant in a mean way or anything. Thank you, Brad, for giving me magic a shout-out. By the way, Jack Skellingbot is back today. He is here. He took Friday off, so he is officially back. Hi, Bly! Talk to people deserve the Lightborn effect! Exactly! If y'all... If y'all are gonna be in my match and I'm killer, oh, I'm throwing Lightborn at you. I'm gonna be the most toxic killer in the game. <laughs> I freaking still love that. I'm That's this still the highlight of my year. I said this last night on Blight's stream. Someone calling me toxic for running Lightborn, saying that they can't flashlight me the whole game. That's a, still made by year. I still talk about it because I thought it was so funny and so much fun. It was. I just loved it. Thank you for freaking Blight a shout out. Speaking of toxic, I know, right? The most toxic person here is Blight. Yeah, yes, the most toxic me. Yes, we all know Blight is so toxic. <laughs> No, 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 I know you're not toxic. Well, like I said, this was actually a conversation last night on Light Stream about the, not necessarily the toxicity of the game, but how some people can just like say it, like Lightboard is toxic and stuff. Like, the way I play DPD is I try to make it fun for everybody. I try to make it fun for everybody. I will admit, some part of me sometimes will get toxic. If I'm playing killer, yeah, sometimes I'll slug or sometimes I'll. No, I never really camp because I can't stand camping. It just kind of annoys me in general. But I will do things like that. But it's also a game. So there's no reason to get all but hurt over things sometimes. You know what I mean? I'm going to grab some food so I'll be lurking. No worries. Go get some good foods, Logical. And thank you so much for hopping in and hanging out for a few minutes. I hope you get all the good foods. All the good foods. I had, all I've had today is cereal. I had just cereal today. Which was good. I... Just needed something to put in my stomach before stream, really, is all I needed. But that is what we'll be doing today. We'll be playing DVD. We'll be having as much fun in the fog as possible. And then we'll be, um, if, like I said, if it just gets to be too much, like some days it happens, um, we'll switch to Disney. But I don't have plans at the moment to switch over to it. And then, unfortunately, this Friday I will not be home. So this will be one of those weeks where I won't be here on Friday. However, I think I'm going to try... Um, since Saturdays are free most of the time for me now, um, used to be where we had guests come over on Saturdays, but they've been coming over on Sundays now, so I, I don't know, they might come over Saturday this week, because I'll play on this, but, um, I'm gonna try and squeak in my Friday stream on Saturday, because what I want to do is I want to play spoopy games 
on my variety day. And I don't want to switch out my DVD because I, I do love playing DVD. I really do. So I don't really want to switch out those days. Um, but so this week I'm going to try and squeak in variety on Saturday. And the plan is if I can, we'll go back to Frambo and try and either probably won't finish it, but we'll try and get a little farther in that story. And then throughout October, every Friday or Saturday, depending on what happens, we'll play a variety spoopy game for the month of October. And then um, on Halloween, since it's a Monday, I want to play a variety game to be something spoopy, but I'm not sure yet if I will or if I'll just do some more DVD. I don't know, but that's like a month away, so we're not going to talk about that, but that's just the current like thought process going through my head. Hello, Jelly! Thank you so much for feeding and petting Sally! How are you doing? Is everything going good? Is the move going smooth? I hope. Because moves sometimes, oof. They can be rough, and sometimes they can be, well, they're never fun. Well, they're fun, but they're not fun, you know what I mean? Like, they're fun, like, after it's all done and said, but other than that, <laughs> other than that, they can be really stressful. My toxic curse! No! <gasps> the house echoes now! <laughs> yup, yup, I know that, yup. Everything out, is everything out and moved? It's so weird, like, once, once everything is kind of gone and, like, the house is empty and it's, like, you don't realize how much space you really had and stuff like that. And then also, like, when it echoes like that, it's kind of, like, the creepiest feeling. It is the creepiest feeling. I remember when I moved into my house, it was like that. It was, like, we didn't have everything moved in yet, but we were there and we were waiting for, like, the cable guy to show up to install our cable and everything. Or not our cable, but, or internet stuff, but... The cable guy was coming in. We were sitting in the house, and there was barely anything in there. And it was just, like, so, like, it was, like, so creepy. It was, like, so quiet and so echoey because, like, nothing was in the house. But it was, like, me. I think my mom was hanging out with me. And then, like, we had, like, maybe our couch there. <laughs> I think that was all we had moved in because we hadn't moved yet. We were just had a couple things at the house, and we were kind of waiting just for this guy to show up. And then we were moving in through the weekend. And this was, like, on a Friday or something. But, yeah, I know that feeling. I was bored, a woman accor- Wait, what? According to someone today, what? Somebody said that like in an endgame chat? Were they trying to be mean? Like, what's that? Ah, I still drinking my coffee this morning. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, oh, I have one new thing to show you guys. We'll show, I'll show you on the new screen. So if you guys redeem, um, I think I renamed it to Perk Roulette. Uh, I have a new thing that'll roll for perks that I'll show you guys here in just one second. But, um, if you guys are new here, the way we play DVD is we play as Survivor most of the time because I enjoy Survivor more. I get a little anxious playing Killer. Sometimes, um, I get more anxious on stream playing Killer than I do off stream, but... We play Survivor as our main. No, we don't main anybody. We take a roller, we roll for the day, see who we get to choose, or who it chooses to play as the day. And then you guys can change it up or whatever throughout the day. But as soon as we survive in a match, then we go play that killer we survived against. And sometimes it could be an extremely popular killer for me that I love playing, or sometimes it could be like Nurse, who I don't necessarily don't like playing, but don't enjoy playing either. So... That is how we play here. We'll switch over to the end screen here in just one second, and we'll get our roller going, and I'll show you guys the new thing as well. We just got rid of all the sofas and seating stuff because it was, oh, it was all broken. Oh, okay. Was that what was going on yesterday? I know I was over in Blossom's chat, and you were trying to play with them, and I know you, um, I think I had gotten up a few times, and I remember hearing you say you had to go because it was getting loud. Oh, some ass hat on DVD mad because I was a female gamer. If, that still blows my mind. Why is that such a big deal? Why is that such a big deal? Are you just mad that like there is a woman that actually could beat you at a video game and we are sometimes better than you? That's what I always take it as. They just mad because they ain't good and we are sometimes better. Yep, that was what was going on. Nice days. I just remember, I, like, I had to get up a few times because 
I was trying to do stuff, and then I was also trying to hang out in uh, her stream, and then I got up to go do the laundry, and um, hadn't started it. Everything was in the laundry, but didn't start it. <laughs> so I had to get up more times than I was intending, because I had to check it a few times after that. The person with the truck just showed up without saying they were on the way, so I had to just go with no warning. Freaking hate that. Like, I'm a person who I don't like people showing up unexpectedly anyway. I like a warning. Especially if it's like a company doing something for me or whatever. Like, please give me some warning. One, I have dogs. And I need to make sure, like, they're in an area where they're good and not freaking out. But at the same time, like, I don't like people showing up unexpectedly with no warning. It's not cool. Not cool. Especially if I have other plans. Especially if I have other plans. But, well, I hope everything got done and went well, though, Jelly. I really do. I hope everything's going as smooth as possible. I know it can be super stressful. I know it can be a lot of work and everything. But I hope everything's going well. I hope everything's going well and as smooth and easy and everything as possible. So much he commented on my Steam profile and said, born female? Seriously? They went as far as commenting on your Steam profile that? <laughs> I would have been like, yes, thank you, I was. <laughs> and? What's your point? I just don't get it. I don't get it. Like, if you gotta be so butt- I don't mean, even call it butt hurt. I don't even know what you would call that. If you gotta be so offended by that, you got bigger issues in your life, sir, ma'am, whatever you may be. You got bigger issues. I just love it when you get someone in this game who is bitter or whatever, and they go through like the extensive amount to make sure they keep talking to you for whatever reason. I just like, yeah, I would have too, but I like, at first I would have like commented and then I would have probably deleted it later. I would have been like, yes, thank you. And, but I would have deleted it later. But anyway, I just love it when they go through the extra effort to say things like that. Like I had that one person who I said that they were, they were camping me in the game and I was just having fun with it. I was like, oh, thank you for camping. Oh, you know, great trip, blah, blah, blah. They literally went onto like every platform that I was on. They went into my Discord. They messaged me on Discord. They went into uh, messaging me on Twitch. And they like went into like all of my social media and told me good game. Like no, and I'm talking like they didn't say just good game. They they went into like an extensive amount of work to tell me like I was being toxic for hanging on a hook. Extended light mag here. Hello, Drax! How have you been? Oh, thank you for giving Drax a shout out. Your gratitude is acknowledged. <laughs> Should have commented back for a tick. <laughs> Kinda, yeah. He was mad because I. He was mad. Oh no, he was mad because I believe. Oh, he was face camming Bubba. Oh, and Marie and I finished our gens. We DC. What if he was that same Bubba? I don't remember their name. That was that's the person like I'm talking about. Where like they were a Bubba and they just went onto every platform to make sure that they would tell me that I was being toxic for I don't even remember what. Nothing. I literally was camped and tunneled out and then they left everyone to bleed. And I was the toxic one. But I just love it how they put all of this effort to go into like all of my social media to tell me this. And I'm always like, thank you. I apparently left a great impression on you to have you be so upset that you went onto every platform to tell me the same thing. And I appreciate it. Because apparently I left an impression. I don't care what kind of impression, but you still had me in your thoughts where I forgot about them about five minutes later. In my day. It wasn't, they, they came into my Discord, but they didn't actually write in the Discord. They sent me a message. They, they joined my, misco my, miscord, my Discord just to message me. They messaged me on Twitter. They messaged me, or not Twitter, um, Twitch. And they, I think they even messaged me on Steam. And I was like, seriously? Get away from me! I think I blocked them everywhere. Oh no, Drax! Oh, you had COVID, didn't you, Drax? Sick and busy? Is that still like? Are you still sick from COVID? 
I'm so sorry you got that. I hope you're feeling so much better, though. Hi, Maria! He was not my toxic bubba, though. Oh, I've seen that guy. Or girl. I don't know if they're a guy or girl. I've seen that one. Um, the funny thing is I was watching somebody else the other day. I don't remember who it was. I'm trying to remember. But they were their killer as well, and they said the exact same thing. Hi, SK! Imagine me talking about that ass type bubba that kept hitting me on hook last night and stood there until I died on my first hook. I don't get it. I don't get it. What's jelly eating? <gasps> Meatloaf with a bowl of rice? I don't like rice, really. I'm just kind of like, it's so blah to me unless it's actually fried rice. But that's not too bad. That's not too bad. But that was kind of like that bubba for me. It's like, I don't I couldn't even tell you now how it all went down because it was so long ago, but it's like, I was just having a good time on stream being like, oh, thanks for camping, blah, blah, blah. You know, I try and be as nice as possible. And they were like, I wasn't going to play that way until you threw God Palette or something. And I'm like, so you tunneled me and let us all suffer because I threw God Palette? <laughs> I don't know. I'll never understand why people are like this, but... They want to be like that. You know, they got bigger problems in their life. I will move on and have fun in more games and totally, totally just laugh about you the rest of my life because you entertained me, entertained me so much. I'm a lot better. Good. Still fatigued. Just working a lot right now. I'm so sorry you're working a lot. I'm glad you're doing a lot better, though. I am. I am. I'm glad you're doing so much better, but I'm sorry you're fatigued. I know that's been... That is one of those things where I've heard people say that fatigue is one of the ones... Now, I don't know a lot about it because I've never had it, but I've heard fatigue is one thing that sticks around for a while. Well, I hope the work calms down for you, Drax, and everything, and I hope you get 100% better very soon and you can get back to normal and everything. A bowl of chili with a blueberry muffin? I wouldn't mind that. I wouldn't mind that. My bowl of chili and then a little bit later, eat my muffin. Thank you, Patrick, and SK, a shout out. I'll never understand, though, why people also will hit you on hook and just sit there until you die. Like, what? 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 Like, thank you. Thank you for all the love taps. I love it. Thank you. I appreciate it. Like I said, I try and kill them with kindness because I think that'll piss them off more. Watching me get mad probably makes them laugh, so I try and just make them angry by being all happy. Not happy about it, but you know what I mean? By, by using kindness about it. That's my new tactic. I ain't gonna get mad. I'm just gonna sit there and I'm gonna laugh and I'm gonna try and make them mad for being the way they are. I'm just on lunch, but I wanted to say hi. It's been a while. It has been a while, but it's all good. Uh, I understand life comes first and everything. It happens. I understand. But thank you so much for popping in and saying hi. It's so good to see you. Uh, I hope lunch is going well. Hope you're having lots of good stuff for lunch as well. I will never understand why people throw flashbangs at people on hook. Me neither. I don't know why people would do that. Who? Who would do that? <laughs> I don't know who would do that. I'm so freaking dizzy today. Like, every time I move, I feel like I'm going to pass out. No, SK! Are you still, are you still having a rough time? I'm so sorry. I know you've been having a rough couple weeks. No, I don't like hearing that. I hope you get better soon. I hope everything gets better soon. Man, I've had... I've had dizzy spells before, and I freaking hate them because they're actually super creepy. But, man, I don't like them. I haven't had one in quite a while, so I'm super... like Whatever was causing them for me for a while, I don't know if it's better or whatever the case was, but I, I for a while there, I was having, like, just like the most random of dizzy spells. And it wasn't anything bad. It would just be like a little bit like I would feel a little off and then I would get kind of sick because just the motion would make me feel sick. But uh, they were kind of creepy because I was always worried that it would happen at the most opportune time saying like I'm out in public or something, which it did once. I was at the grocery store with my mom and I got kind of dizzy and we literally were like in the frozen food aisle. And I, we just like, I said, mom, we got to stop for just a sec. And she's like, huh? You know, you okay? And I could just feel myself like swaying. And I just close, like what I usually do is when this happens, I just like close my eyes 
and I take some deep breaths, and then I'm usually okay. And then I was. Then we went about our, our shopping trip, but I don't like them. They are so scary. But I haven't had one in, like, a couple years now, so I don't know what that was all about. Maybe I just, like, had the lack of something in my system at the time. Right? We talked about that. No being sick. Yes. Everybody, we talk about that. Don't get sick. I know it's sometimes hard not to, but don't. We, we want everybody to be happy, healthy, safe, and all those good things. But if you are sick, I hope you get better soon. I hope you get better very soon and get back to normal and not feel so bad or sick or fatigued or dizzy or whatever it is you are going through. I hope you get better soon because we don't like to hear people sick of any kind. We want everyone to be as healthy and happy as possible because, you know, it's no fun being sick. It is no fun. Not at all. I just almost fell off the toilet. No. SK, no. Well, no, I was going to say, well, at least you were in the bathroom, but no, that wouldn't make any difference. No, SK. Well, go lay down. Get some rest if you can. Whatever may be causing it, I hope it's all okay. But if you need to lay down and get some rest, it's all Gouda. It is. You come first. Always remember that. And make sure... Make sure everyone in the house knows if, if, if people are home that you are feeling kind of under the weather in case something happens. Like, they can check on you quite often. I have to do that sometimes with my mom. If I know she's, she's feeling kind of sick, I have to make sure, like, I'm aware that if something happens, I can get to her very, very fast. I have coughing fits that cause my vision to white out. Super scary, especially when I'm driving. Oh, yeah, yeah. I always had that fear, like, when I was going through... Whatever was causing me to feel dizzy. For a while, I think I kind of figured it out, but um, I'll talk about that in a sec. But I always had the fear, like, something would happen while I was driving. And if, if someone is with me, I always kind of, like, try and warn them. Like, if something's coming on, like, I'm going to pull over or... I may, you may need to, like, take the wheel for a second until we can get to pull over, depending on where we're at, you know, and everything. But ugh, it's such a scary thing. No pulling in Elvis. I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> I was just going to say, please don't, please don't, please don't do an Elvis. Ooh, got to fix dinner. Just mom and the cats. We'll make sure your mom is keeping an eye on you, though, just in case. Just in case. You never know. Elfie has been extra cuddles, cuddly with me today. Aww. Well, I'm glad Elfie has been extra cuddly today with you. That always helps. That always helps me. When I'm feeling down, sick, bad, whatever, and my kitty wants to cuddle, makes me feel a little better. I get them, and then tons of little lines in my eyes that look like worms. Oh, okay, so, like, lines. Because I was thinking, like, you have, like, little floaters. Like, I get those every once in a while, but those are just, like, random. They have nothing to do with anything else. <laughs> just random little floaters I get every once in a while. But, no, with my... When I used to get dizzy spells, um... It's it's been a couple like it's been a couple years since I got them, but one thing I notice is um, t when I tend to get like anxious or um, like stressed or whatever like in those kind of realms like anxious stressful situations, I for some reason will hold my breath. I, I will I don't know why I will just like my hold my breath. And I, I, it must just be like a natural reaction for me when I get stressed or anxious to just like hold my breath for whatever reason. And I noticed this one time I was, something was going on and I had like two or three dizzy spells in a day, but it was something super stressful was going on. And I think that was what it is. I think it was just, I was stressed and I was like holding my breath. And I don't know if that was causing the dizzy spells or if it was a coincidence. But um, I tried every time when that would happen and I felt like I was having an anxiety attack or whatever that I would try not to hold my breath. <laughs> so I, I don't know if that was it, but that is just one thing I noticed happened to me once, whether it had anything to do with it or if it was just that one time, but who knows, who knows. But I used to do that. I don't find myself doing it anymore, though. I don't know. 
sell. You should sell your. You get fuzzy bike. dots. I like I said, I get floaters every once in a while, but that, I don't think that has anything to do with anything. Hello, Holly. Thank you so much for the lurk. Thank you, Brad, for giving Holly a shout. If you guys are not following Holly, go do so. She is an amazing content creator. She does play DVD, but she also is a variety streamer. She does variety games, and if you guys want to have some fun, go hang out on her stream. She's amazing. Oh, when you have coughing spells like that, get tons of floaters. Floater, I floaters, not not anything else. I floaters. <laughs> Magic, no, the ones in your eyes. <laughs> I don't know. Are they called anything else? That's what I've always called them because I really actually don't know. That's what I call them. That they might have really be called that, but no magic. <laughs> I haven't had one of those in a while. I haven't had one of those in a while in my eyes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I was half listening. It's okay. It's okay. No, we're talking about the ones in your eyes <laughs> when you get like those like little like little. And those little ghostly like things that float around in your eyes and you can just like follow them. Those ones. At least they're not, yes, at least they're not sneakers. Yep, you guys are totally right. <laughs> oh my gosh, leave it to you guys, I swear, I swear. Alright, let's go hop over to the screen. And pick our survivor for the day so we can get our day started and everything, but... Well, nonetheless, like I said, if you guys aren't feeling well today or you're having a rough day, I hope you all feel better. Stay safe and everything. And just remember to always take care of yourself first. My stream doesn't come first or whatever. Nothing comes first but you. So always remember to take care of yourself if you aren't feeling well or just, you know, having a day. There are days where I'm just having a day and I feel like crawling up into my bed and sitting there doing nothing like staring at the ceiling well not staring at the ceiling usually i'll be on my phone but you know what i mean always remember to take care of yourself first my bad. <laughs> love the transition thank you it's special for me spoopy season uh, i freaking loved it i tried to do as much spoopy things for my my stream because i wasn't going to change everything like i wasn't going to change the entire layout so I found this transition because I will admit it, I have like a really bad problem of going onto Etsy and looking at all of the stream transitions. I think it's because I can't make them. I can make all the stuff for my stream, like alerts and everything else you see almost on the screen, except for, you know, like all the art and stuff, but, um, but I can't make transitions. So I love to go on there and I love to just look at transitions all day long. I don't know what it is about the transitions that I love so much. But I found that one right before, um, or not right before, but when I was trying to get ready for spoopy season and trying to do everything, I saw that one. I'm like, I need, I need. It kind of has the feeling of Nightmare Before Christmas with like the woods, but it's also got spoopy at the same time. Did you see my new TikTok? No, I didn't. I forgot to get on TikTok today. Uh, if you want, go ahead and post it in mod, mods chat, or I will check it out um, after stream. I just didn't open my TikTok today. I am so bad with the last couple days opening my TikTok. I don't know why. All right, let me go grab our spinner and let's see who we're going to play today. Really quick, um, I am almost done with prestiging all of my killers to at least level one. Dredge has like two levels or three levels to go, I think. And I will be done with prestiging all killers to level 1. After that, I'm just going to kind of randomly spend my points to put it into, you know, people I play for the day. So let's see who we're going to get. See if we need to put points into... Oh, we're going to play Kane again! We're going to play Kane again today. Alright, I have no problems playing Kate. We recently got her. And the spitter, but it's all Gouda. So we'll play Kate. I think I might need to put some points into her because we recently played her and used a lot of items, so. I have the meat cooking, just chilling on the sofa, chatting with mom and drinking. Ooh, ooh great Powerade. So what's what's for dinner though, SK? I know you said meat's cooking, but is it like, are we having hamburgers? Are we just having some kind of meat? Or are we putting the meat in something? 
Posted in mods? Okay, I'll go watch it in just one sec. I'm starting to do digital art since I got ooh new devices that are good for it. You should do some digital art streams then. If you ever have time. Not no pressure or nothing. I freaking love digital art. I love watching like I love watching art things, especially on stream and everything. Um and that's one thing I really wish I was good at. I wish I was good at art, like drawing and stuff and digital art. Like I can make like I made this scene that we're currently on. I made it. I, I you know, I put all the things on it. Obviously, I didn't make, like, the bubbles next to me or behind me or the, um, whatever you want to call it. Like, the lights and stuff. I didn't make all the things that I added onto it. But the scene itself I made. And I can do things like that. Because I've made, um, my starting soon screen, my be right back screen. I made all of that. And I freaking love doing that kind of stuff. But I can't do, like, animations very well, and I can't make, um, I can't draw, I can't do emotes or digital things like that. But I do love making things for my stream when it comes to, like, paint, sh or not paint shop, Photoshop and stuff like that. I freaking love Photoshop. <gasps> pork chops! Ooh, num! Well, I hope your pork chops come out good. I had my headphones half off because I was pouring a drink and here. Spinner! Oh, spinner! And then remember you said spinner. <laughs> not spinner. I'm not that good. I'm sure you're great. I'm sure you're great. If you ever, like, also, just as a, if you want, you can always post some stuff in Discord as well if you want to share. You don't have to. I understand. I totally understand. Um, but if you ever want to post, like, art in the Discord as well, be my guest. We have an art section in our Discord um, if you want to... Uh, share, but never feel pressured. I understand because um, I used to love to write and everything, and I don't haven't written anything in a long time. But I would be very anxious to post things that I've written in my Discord, even if it's you know people I know and everything. But I still get kind of anxious about it. Oh, the Galaxy S twenty two Ultra. Oh, I remember seeing that. And the Tab 8 Plus. I remember seeing those because I remember thinking, like, I kind of want those because I want to, like, attempt to be, like, you know, do stuff like that. But I, I just, I've never gotten them just because I'm not good. <laughs> but it has been something, like, kind of, like, on my want list because I would like to attempt it. Last of the pork chops cooking. Mom is such a picky eater. So we eat a lot of pork chops. I know that feeling. I know that feeling. My, 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 my dad's kind of a picky eater, but not. He's gotten more picky, so it's like we don't eat as much as we used to. And it's like, and my brother is, my brother is one of those eaters where he's the most unpicky picky eater. He will eat what you make, but he will not really be enjoying it. But he's not like gonna sit there and complain about it or not eat it. But he's like the most pickiest unpicky eater. I'm still working on my first piece I started like two months ago. They are both amazing. My Samsung. Oh, they are both amazing. My Samsung ecosystem it is complete. Nice. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad you're still working on Like, I'm glad you're, you're working. You're, you're having, I hope you're having fun with it. I started two months ago and I hope it's going well. Like I said, if you ever want to share it, be my guest, but you don't have to. I'm never going to ever pressure anyone to share anything they don't want. But I hope you're enjoying it. I hope it comes out amazing. I know it will. I know it will. I know it will. Um, let me show you guys something real quick. So if you guys choose Perk Roulette, I have this new thing as you see on my screen. We'll come over to the screen to do it because it's a little easier for you guys to see. Where we will roll four random perks. And I'll show you guys how it works. So I have it through this website, and then it's through, um, it then is put onto my screen, stream, screen, excuse me, whatever, for you guys. So we would go like this. Oh, it's not working! It's supposed to, like, refresh. <laughs> well, when I roll it, it's supposed to refresh for you guys. Of course it breaks when I'm not, when I'm trying to show it off. Well, if it doesn't work, we will do something else. But let me see if I can refresh it. Where is it? What did I name it? Survivor Perks? Uh, 
Oh, so I have to push refresh on this page. Not the website. Okay, I'll have to get used to that. I have to put refresh on this page and it'll show me what I get. I don't have to roll on this page. Good to know, but I'll have to work out some other system. But that is how we'll do it. We'll come over here, we'll get that, and then I will do a roller like that instead of using the chat bot to do it. So it's kind of more interactive for you guys. You guys can see the perks on the screen and everything, but apparently I have to do some rework with it to make it um, a little bit smoother. I didn't realize that I had to push the refresh through OBS. So we'll work on that. I've learned not to ask mom how her food is. It is never an answer. I will like, oh, I know that feeling, yeah. That's like, like I said, that's like with my brother. Like, no, I'll still ask him even though I know the answer. I'll be like, so how'd you enjoy dinner? And the answer is always, not always, if I if I know what's coming, it's always like, oh, it was edible because I, didn't, I don't want to eat it again, you know, or something like that. And he's like, he's so picky about it, but he'll eat it. It's like, he's not upset that he's eating it. But he would rather have something else. But um, my dad mainly, it's not like he's picky. He's just like he doesn't want to eat things like that. And normally if we ask him if he liked it, his answer always, if it's delayed. Because he's not, he's, like a, he's a nice person. He won't feel like it was gross or anything. But if it's like a delayed reaction when you ask him and he's like, it was good. It's like, no, it wasn't. <laughs> You didn't like it. You you delayed your answer. So it, my mom is very unpicky, though, so never have to worry about her. And I'm usually the one cooking, so if I'm cooking it, I like it, most likely. I'll drop it in Discord later. All right, sounds good. Uh, lunch is over, though. I have a good one, everyone. Thank you, Drax, so much for popping in and saying hi. I hope the rest of your day goes amazing and thank you so much for hanging out with us and i look forward to seeing that like i said never feel pressured though if you don't want to it's all okay i was just putting that out there if you ever do want to share it the discord is open and we have a section specially for art so let me go watch magic's tiktok real quick i didn't get on my tiktok this morning What all Pokemon ah, let me turn the volume up. Left to work on other than evolution. No, replay. Thank y'all. Wesker takes me on a tour of dead dog. How was the tour? I like that song, by the way. Oh, I got messages I got to check out, by the way. <laughs> I haven't got on TikTok in a few days. <laughs> Thank you, Ryan, so much for giving Drax another shout out. I like that TikTok. How was the tour of dead dog then? Was it a good tour? So yeah, I like that. I like when you do get some killers like that who are just like having fun. Ten out of ten, nice, nice. Just saying, and it says nothing to do with that. But Dead Dog is actually one of my favorite maps. I love Dead Dog Saloon; it's one of my favorites. But ten out of ten, good, nice, great. Wesker, or that Wesker at least was an amazing tour guide. Amazing tour guide. Um, oh, we're playing Kate. I already forgot. We we rolled like ten minutes ago. I don't remember. Um, oh, one last thing really quick. Um, so today they announced, now I don't know how I feel about this, but I'm kind of bleh. But today they announced like, PUBG and Dead by Daylight are going to have a crossover or an event or something together. No idea anything about it other than I just saw that on their Twitter account. I didn't read about it, but apparently they're doing something together. I have no opinion on it. That is all I'm going to say. Because what's the point of that being in with this game? I don't know. But I have a feeling it could maybe be something very similar to the um, Attack on Titans crossover. Where to me it was nothing. I, I didn't really care because I don't know anything about t Attack on Titans. Not my thing. Um, I don't buy outfits. So it was nothing to me, but I'm happy for everybody who got something really cool. And the outfits were great. I won't say anything about that. The outfits were amazing. I did like a lot of them. 
But it was nothing special to me. Kind of feel like this is going to be the same way. It's whatever. Whatever they have, cool. I'm happy for those who like the crossover. Just me personally, I'm like, whatever. It's If it's there, it's there. If it's not, it's not. I have no interest in it at all, but also if that's what you like, cool, congratulations! You got PUBG coming to Dead by Daylight some way or another. But I'm not looking forward to it, but I'm also kind of like whatever at the same time. The Cemetery is probably my second favorite. I think Dead Dog is my favorite because, um... I don't know, I just like Dead Dog a lot. Um, I think the cemetery would be my second favorite because its size is a little overwhelming at times, but I do love it. Because I love the aesthetic and everything. And then probably my third favorite, oh, I don't know. I like so many. Ormond is amazing too, I really like Ormond. But I think the cemetery and Dead Dog would probably be my top two. He legit carried me around spitting around the map. Oh my gosh, he kept spitting the entire map? <laughs> I thought maybe he was just like walking you around the map. Exactly, they're two totally different games. Leary's is really good too. I would lump Leary's though into inside map though. I, I would put that in kind of a different category because it's inside versus outside. Um, it would probably, Leary's would be my favorite inside map, for sure. I don't, I like Midwitch, though, depending on, um, like, the killer you go running up against and who you're playing, maybe. But Midwitch would be probably second. But Leary's would probably be number one when it came to inside maps. I despise that map, too, SK. For some reason these days, I was saying this on, um, I think it was Blossom Stream. I feel like that map these days, if you're playing killer, all you get are survivors just dropping pallets. Like, literally. They're doing nothing else but just dropping pallets. And it's a very he pallet-heavy map. It's it's just known to be that way. But I feel like as killer lately on that map, I get extremely bored. And then as survivor, I just don't like it. I don't really like it at all. I can never freaking find a gen, even though I know where they're at. But I can't ever freaking find them, and I just don't like it on either side. I miss Hawkins. Same. Same, same, same. Uh, I know they said the rumor was Stranger Things would be back in October. Now I'm kind of... October, excuse me. No, um, uh, December. But I am starting to kind of wonder if it's really going to come back as a new chapter or not. Because supposedly the next chapter is a Night Killer. And that would be around the October... Why do I keep saying October? November, December time frame, which was the rumor of Stranger Things. So either it's getting pushed back, or the rumor is not true, or the chapter is just returning with Hawkins, and it's not going to be an entire new chapter. That's my three theories. Those are my three theories. I really just hope mainly maybe it's pushed back and we're getting a new chapter, but I don't know. But same, I kind of I kind of miss Hawkins. I didn't get to play it as much. Because um, I was newer to the game back then, and then I didn't play a lot between the time I got the game and when it disappeared. But I know I didn't... <laughs> I know I didn't like it back then. But now that it's gone, I really actually do miss it. But in, in all honesty, it wasn't my least favorite map when it came to inside maps. I just, when I was newer to the game, I hated inside maps no matter the case. No matter the case, I hated inside maps. But now I don't mind them as much, but it, it all depends on the map too. What are we doing? Oh, falling from a great height still. No. All right, let's stick on balance for a little while, just to give us some distance while we're doing this. If nothing's working, then we'll go do something else, but... Yeah, we're gonna have to put some points into her here pretty soon. Oh, I wanted to change my charms to my spoopy charms. We got spoopy charms for um, last year, so I'm gonna put those on for the month until we get new ones, because also... Uh, the Halloween event should be coming out soon. I don't know when, though. 
Oh, the Night Killer is a Halloween event, I heard. Is that what it is? I haven't really... I thought I heard that it would probably be around the November, December time frame, but I don't know. I That's just what I think I heard. My memory sucks anyway, so I don't know if I heard correct. Yeah, I'm not happy with the For Honor. Yeah, same. I'm not extremely excited for it, but I'm also gonna just wait and see. I mean, I'll admit I'm not extremely looking forward to it, nor does it sound interesting. Because I just... I don't know, you know? Um, but I'm excited to see at first what it's like, you know? It, who knows? The killer might be this freaking amazing, powerful, creepy killer. Or cre not creepy, but scary. I don't know. I'm just gonna have to wait. It is Halloween event stuff, is it? Okay, alright. So it should be coming out within the next few weeks, I would assume. Has anyone heard when this Halloween event stuff is actually starting? I'm trying to remember last year, because I participated last year of Halloween events. And I know there's been stuff posted in, um, like, discords and stuff. Well, it's been on social media as well, but about it, but I haven't heard any, like, time frame. And I have no idea from last year. I'm sorry, I'm the only one not ready. I haven't, I can't remember from last year when everything started. I need to get some points, and then we'll put some points into Kate, because I am running out. I'm not running out of stuff, but I'm getting low. Around the 18th? Is that what you're trying to say, Magic? Or around... Around something. Oh, around resets! And then SK said the 18th. Okay, so... It's thir yeah, that would make sense. 13th, 18th. Okay, cool. Because I'm excited. I, I loved... Last year's Halloween event was a lot of fun. And um, I freaking loved going around kicking the pumpkins. Whether I needed to or not, didn't care. It was just kind of fun to go around kicking pumpkins, in my opinion. When that event ended, I was like, no more pumpkins to kick, though. The bone chill event with the snowmen was amazing, too. But I know this year they're going to have some new things in the Halloween event as well. They're going to have, what, a tome like last year. But they have something about an energy I, I don't remember what it was, how it was worded, but something like you have to collect energy or something. And I'm kind of anxious to see what it's all about. Like, I have no idea. But I'm excited. I love, I love special events in DVD. I think it just adds to the game. And be, me being a spoopy person and loving spoopy stuff. I'm looking especially forward to it. I got my charms on. I don't have any creepy outfits though for um, Urban of Nia. Any creepy outfits or anything for uh, Kate. But if we play Michaela, I'll put her Halloween outfit on for the month. I risk it for exposing him. Damn it! Freaking hate when I do that! I forgot I took off head on! He lost me and I forgot I took out head on! Oh well. Cause I'm using- I use Lucky Break to get rid of the- uh, to lose the killer, but then I like to try and do head on at the same time. Cause I don't know I'm in there. And I took out head on for balance cause of my challenge. And then it caught me. I want to be a snowman. Same. I really, 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 really hope they bring that event back. And if, if what I'm thinking is true, a lot of people loved it. A lot of people liked the snowman. So if they want to please the DBD community, I would highly recommend them bringing that back nonetheless. Thank you. What the hell? Where where did you come from? At least he went after the Claudette. 
Freaking starting my day with a ghost chase ain't fun. Because last year's Halloween event w had a tome, and I think they said they'll do that again this year. That is where all the great Michaela stuff came from. Her Halloween outfit, the charms I'm currently wearing. I don't know if the the Bing Bong ghost came from there, but I know the um, black cat did. And I know the doctor was in last year's Halloween tome, but I missed all the doctor stuff because I didn't have him at the time and I didn't want to get him to complete the challenges. Oh, Jesus! Freaking, I hate ghost fans! Leave it alone! He's probably got I'm all ears. <laughs> Love Lucky Brick! Alright, you can have me. <laughs> you ain't getting hits on me though! You're just grabbing me! Are you getting her grabs? You ain't getting no downs! Oh no! I was like two... Two seconds away from hitting that last skill check. First match of the day doesn't count anyway. Had a doctor last night with a very good bedside manner. Really? <laughs> you know what? Personally, I freaking love playing against doctors when they're one fun and they've got good bedside manner, of course. And they're not extremely loud, if you know what I mean. Oh, thank you. Urban of 80 Mia, he's coming. I don't really want to work on that, Jen. Okay, you do that. I have actually found a new love for playing Doctor too. I played him a little bit off stream last week. Not this, I didn't play DVD this week, but last week. He's so much fun to play. I don't totally understand like his shocks and everything effectively, but I still had a lot of fun. Caught it throwing that way early. Reckon I'm trying to get away from Claudette. Or Claudette and the Yui. I'm hoping this is a nice ghost face and I'll just realize I'm on death hook. And kind of go somewhere else for a while. I popped my gen. Oh, wait, maybe that was him. He made the... Oh, just a second. Claude at first. 
Anyways, he made the colonoscopy and this pap smear. Not as bad. Just hope he changed. Oh, changed gloves between the two. Yes, same. <laughs> well, I'm glad that we had a doctor that made it not so bad. She might have resilience. Oh, never mind. Claudia just stole my gen! Oh. Never mind. Yui said I leave. Claudia just came up behind me and stole my spot. glowing over here what is this what is this <laughs> me and Nia are just sitting here what is this is this something for Halloween cuz ew it's gross but I don't know what it is Has anybody seen that in the game yet? Or is that just like something weird for me? Hi, Denny! How are you doing? A uh, med kit will take. Yeah, he's gonna come right over here. Cause I was up on top of the hill. Yeah, I couldn't get him exposed. thing for so long oh okay so it's tome 5 survivor challenge it's a thing for a, a survivor from an earlier tome oh okay cuz see I don't I haven't seen nothing from tome 5 also well, baby hello welcome on in yeah I have never seen anything from tome 5 and I've never freaking seen that now I'm excited to go to tome 5 and see what that's about let me see what this is real quick. Oh, info about the Halloween event. Main objective of this year's Halloween is to collect energy during the trial. Collected energy can be deposited in the trial and progress counts toward all community challenges, which will be available in the tome. Those were kind of annoying if, you, if I do say so myself, but it is what it is. Energy can be collected by stunning a killer or downing a survivor. Tome includes various events like destroy pumpkins. I remember seeing that. Collecting and depositing energy, event gen repair, event hooks. <gasps> Off uh, outfits include Kate and Hag. Bitch. Nice. Okay, so it's like, um, it's kind of like the thing from the other one we just did. Whatever it was called. Uh, so community challenges. You should do the challenge. Yeah, I've never done anything. Like, I'm a little bit newer to DVD. I've only been playing for about a year and a half now. Um, and I only focus on current tomes. And then I go back and do old tomes when I have a chance. I am actually working on an old tome challenge at the moment, but I'm only on, like, tome one or two. I think. Let me go see where this one is. Mo Baby, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on into Skelly Town. Oops, not current tome. Yeah, tome five I've never touched. Never touched. I have never touched three. Well, I may have touched it. No, I've never touched three. Let me see if I've touched five. Nope. I have never done nothing in five. So that's why I've never seen it. And then being that I came in and round tome. Where did I come in? Tome seven, I think. 
I think I came in in tome seven. Um, I finished all eight, nine, ten, and eleven, but I'm trying to go back and do one, two, and kind of go on from there. And and I just have never made it to five. I think I'm working on tome two at the moment. Nope, never mind. I don't know where I am, but I'm not on tome five. Encouraging slugging. Yeah, they kind of are. <laughs> they kind of are with that. It needs to be like... The the event we just went through, the, the, the not Halloween, the anniversary event, where all you had to do was collect a, uh, an invitation, and that's all. That that is um, that is what I like. Where all you do is collect something. I don't remember last year's Halloween event. I can't remember what it was you had to do if there was anything special other than the pumpkins. And then, um, I know, like, the snowman event last year, so the bone chill was, um, you had to either, what, be hit in a snowman or hit a survivor in a snowman. But it didn't, it, it didn't, like, um, I don't think it put you down, though, if I c remember correctly. So if you were already injured in a snowman, I don't think you were down. You just were taken out of the snowman. That's what they need to do. They need to not do things that encourage, encourage slugging and also not do things like... You know, downing sur- was it downing survivors? Downing survivors, so I don't like that it's stunning killers because I'm bad at that. It needs to be just like, I don't know, it just needs to be something you collect and then deposit somewhere, not necessarily by doing those kind of actions, just my opinion. You have one survivor challenge across all tomes, nice! I'm way behind. I'm way behind. And, like, in old tomes. Like, I've gone back and cleaned up a little bit, but I'm currently was trying to do everything, like, for instance, like, with this current one, um, I tried to get everything Survivor done before I went back, but I still have two left in this tome that just closed. But I don't like the challenges, so I'm gonna leave them. But, yeah, um, I, I'm... Don't have half the tomes done um, and everything, but I'll get to them eventually. They're there as backup is what I consider them. The snowman was fun, it was. And it didn't like, it encouraged just like some fun times. And like, I remember if you got in the snowman, you weren't downed. You just, um, I think if you got hit while you're in a snowman, this, this killer got their snowman hit, but it didn't down a survivor, it just broke their snowman and so on. I loved moving around the map as a snowman. Same. I, I don't know. Did I ever escape as a snowman? I don't know if I ever escaped. I know it wasn't necessary, but it was fun to try. Downing survivors is better than drowning them? Very true. Very true. Very true. Alright, I need to take a quick break. I need to use the restroom really quick. Um, I know, sorry, it's an early break. I don't normally take breaks this early, but... I must today, so if my mods would like to do some shoutouts on the next screen, they may. And then we'll play more Survivor until we survive. We did not survive our last match. In a way, thank goodness, because I'm bad at Ghostface, but first match of the day doesn't always count. But I will be right back.
turned. I won't go right back through chat. Just one second. Let me get my desk all fixed. You took Victor home with you, Magic? What? You guys went through a hatch together. <laughs> How cute. <laughs> Thank you, SK, so much for feeding Sally. Best way to check that is if you go to Michaela and if you have her purple sweater, then you did escape. I do have her purple sweater. I did get all event items, so... Wait, no. Wait, 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 wait. I think I have a purple sweater. I might not. <laughs> I might be lying. Yeah, I do have a purple sweater. I do, while we're here, actually. We gotta put on our spoopy, Michaela, when we do play her. So I do have her spoopy event item. From last year. <gasps> I stand by this. I need to get Victor a top hat and a monocle. Yes. That, <laughs> that would look so awesome. Pancakes with a pile of bacon. Oh my gosh. That sounds so good. Denny's eating dino nuggies. Oh, Denny, no! With the anchovies! No! Ew! Hey. Magic finally got something good. Ma uh, <laughs> magic with... <laughs> mac and cheese, not magic and cheese. Uh, with a side of onion rings. That I did escape as a snowman. Perfect. Perfect. I couldn't remember. I don't remember what happened a couple days ago, let alone what happened in last year's event. <laughs> Her Xmas sweater, yeah, yeah, her purple Xmas sweater that came with the um, Bone Chill event. I do have it. I thought I collected all of those. Because when I do um, tome challenges, or not tome, but events, I try and make sure that I get everything. Um, back though, back then, last October, or not October, God, I keep saying that. Last December though, um, I know I missed a couple things for like the doctor. Because the tome event, you had to do things as the doctor to get to certain sections. And I know I missed them. Because I didn't have him back then. Magic and cheese! New buffet menu! <laughs> I mean, magic and cheese sounds yummy. It doesn't sound bad, though! But this will be my first year getting to play events. Like, um, so I've been playing since, like, August of 2021. Not August, excuse me, April of, uh, of 2021. So when I first started playing, I got to play in, um, 2021's anniversary event, which was, what, year five? But I didn't really get to play it to its, you know, full potential, because I only had base, base game people and everything. And some of the challenges, sometimes, you know, it's like, you know, escape as Jane, and I didn't have Jane at the time, or whatever. Not, that wasn't one I'm using as an example. But this is the first year that I've got to participate in all of the events and have all of the people and all of the perks and everything so that I can actually get challenges done to make sure that I can complete everything. It's like the um, anniversary event this year. Um, I made sure that I got every mask and that every single killer and every single survivor has one of the event items. So all my survivors have a flashlight, a med kit, a toolbox, and a flan. And then all killers have a flan. But I'm such a completionist when it comes to this game. If there's a special event out and it's not coming back, I am going to do my best to try and make sure I collect every single item, because I want. Whether I use it or not is a different story, but I want. Why wow, all of a sudden had I had a vision of magic with nacho cheese on her head? <laughs> but if we are talking me magic with cheese, I'd make y'all sick because I'm... No, no. 
No, you are not gross. What are you saying? No. No, not even close. No. Oops, sorry. I never run right off the bat. I ever run when I first get into the match. Why? No real reason. Very quiet, though. Fearmonger! Who plays with Fearmonger in this economy? No, I don't agree. I'm not agreeing with magic. <laughs> Is that a demo? It's a demo poppers! A demo poppers with fearmonger. Go figure. Or I shouldn't say go figure, but who would have guessed? I actually like fearmonger. I don't run with it much anymore, though. into the main. I gotta fall from a great height. And if I can do gens up here. Why did he not pick her up? Do you want to have a flashlight? Is that what happened? Being all toxic! Taking out... Everybody's right there, so... <laughs> I'm gonna go do gens while... Everybody's swarming the killer right now. Okay, maybe I should go over there because everyone's injured now. Oh, no! Oh, frick. I'm sorry. I didn't couldn't figure out where she was. Frickin' fearmonger. I didn't know where she was. I'm going down here. Ah! Because of fearmonger, I went to the wrong hook. I thought she was right there, and she wasn't. Then I was trying to find a locker, and I couldn't find one. It's okay, everybody got up the hook, but Fearmonger got me in the butt. Heels. I would loop back around. At least I knew where she was this time. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I double clicked. I do that sometimes.
Man, we are not getting Jens on. He is keeping pressure on us for unhooking and healing. He is keeping the pressure on. Okay, I want to go up in the main for a bit. Hello, D. Why was my balance not activated? Where did I accidentally use balance? No, Meg, I'm coming! I'm coming, the please! Hold on! Hold on, Meg, I'm almost there! No! I was right there! I even risked the fast vault for her! Oh, I feel so bad, I just couldn't get there in time! Like I said, I even risked the fast vault and fast vaulted to make a sound so I could get to her fast. Uh, oops, I wasn't watching. <laughs> Such a bad DVD player. <laughs> oh, I touched the jet! No! <laughs> I'm such a bad DVD player. I have no idea what's going on. I fucked my gen twice. Oh my god. It's okay. I have no I I'm the most confuzzled DVD player you will ever meet. Hey, I might get a gen then though. <laughs> Man, I feel so bad for that Meg though. I was right there. And I would push it as she died to unhook her. I know where there's a med kit, but I don't know if LOD. Or not LOD. <laughs> LOD's in front of me, but if somebody took it. Thank you. She has a flashlight, so she did it. She'll probably get that unhook. <gasps> he actually used a butthole! Well, this isn't the med kit I wanted, but this one will work. I need him to chase me. I'm trying to get him to chase me from up here so that I can get my challenge done. I think Elodie's up here with me. Fearmonger gives you... Fearmonger gives you three or four seconds of exhaustion, so therefore your balance didn't work. I think I remembered that now that you say that. But I had forgotten all about it. Since you ran directly from the gen, yep. I kind of forget about it, because most of the time it doesn't affect me very much, and I don't use balanced anymore, so I kind of forget. I mean, it would work with head on too. I popped the gen because I scared myself. I'm sorry. Don't you stare at me like that, Rebecca. I said sorry. <laughs> I've got like 
happy fingers at the moment. There, sorry, Rebecca. No! Y'all need to chase me up here! Okay. Oh, where'd he go? I swear he was right behind me, so I was breaking off from the hook. Yeah, that's the that's like my biggest problem with this game is there's so much in the game when it comes to perks and everything that I just will totally forget how one works or I'll totally forget the name or I'll totally forget something because my brain's like that. I just forget very easily. She being morried? Damn. <laughs> Oops, I don't know what to do. Missed me. <laughs> I fell from a great height. Am I bad? Well, he's not taking me to basement for my sins. That's all that matters. Sorry, Elodie. Man, I am like the worst DVD player today. I apologize to whoever gets in a match with me today. It ain't gonna be pretty. You don't need to save me, Elodie. You can save yourself. I'm okay with that. I am all good with that if you want to save yourself. I wonder where his buttholes are. Yes, I'm going back this way because there was a gen up here. Or a med kit. fall from a great height. Yes! I'm being worried! <laughs> Elodie. <laughs> Elodie came over and just flashed the killer while I was being worried. You know what? I'll take it. I love being worried in this game. However, I hate the new Mori system and they better scrap that idea 100% and fast. But I got two falls from a great height done. That was all I needed. No, I need one more, but that's all I needed was to fall from a great height. That's why I kept going back to Maine. One, I knew there was a med kit there, so I was hoping to heal myself, but also because if I did get caught up there, at least I could fall. Check hatch, El check hatch, check shack, Elodie. Oh no. This demo played really good though. I mean, I feel bad for the Meg. She only died on second hook because nobody could get to her. And then we got Morried. I'm always happy with a Mori. Nice. She was caught. <laughs> no! 
No, nobody got a new Mori. It's just a whole new way of doing it. The whole new Mori system would be like last person standing. Like, if ever if you're gonna slug, everybody's down, and you have one person standing, you slug that person down. Game over. Mori, instant Mori happens, and game is over. No matter if you got no hooks or anything. I like the idea of the instant Mori. I do like not having to pu push anything, like it automatically goes to it, but I don't like the way it happens. RIP. Well, I thought that was a fun game though still. GG's. I feel bad now that we couldn't get to that Meg just to the fact where he couldn't get his four Moris with his Ebony, but it is what it is. I'm assuming the PTB closed. I don't know if it's still open. I didn't participate in it because I didn't want to see it. Uh, I saw enough from what people were saying, but it is bad. It's really bad. They need, they desperately need to fix that Mori system or whatever you want to call it. And I, I don't think it'll go out that way. I mean, if they do, they're pretty much killing the game. Uh, they're, they're pretty much killing it because they're encouraging, they're, <laughs> they're giving us unbreakable base game while encouraging the killer to still slug with that kind of system in in effect. So in my opinion this was like, why even bother putting Unbreakable as base game if you're gonna allow that to be the, the Mori. No, the, the, on the PTB, on the PTB you could slug everybody and leave them down, like, you don't even have to hook. You could just slug everybody. And then as soon as you catch the final person, it just automatically goes into a Mori. You don't have to push or anything. It just automatically does it and the game's over. Everybody dies. Nobody has to be hooked. And it's not one, it's not one left in the game. It's, it could be all four of you with no hooks or anything. You can all be slugged and instant kill on the very last down but that's the way it needs to be it either needs to be you can push for it if you want because it, it eliminates also slug races it eliminates um which is a fun thing of the game it also eliminates giving someone hatch sometimes when i can't get someone to hatch I will hit them down and take them to hatch. Well, in the new system, if it goes into live servers, you when you hit them, game's over. You can't take them to hatch. Yeah, if that went into live, it would no so many people would give up. I probably would give up. I heard a rumor they're changing the Mori to hatch rules. See that? That would work. Probably. I would I would wait to see it live or in a PTB. Whatever the case is, it cannot be what they had in the PTB. That is all I can say. It cannot be that. Because I guarantee you so many people will put this game down. I mean, I probably would put this game down. Because I would, can almost guarantee it, a lot of killers would do that. Me as a killer... Oh, it's Pinhead. Me as a killer, I have to slug sometimes. Not on purpose. But to get people freaking away from me. You know what I mean? If you're a killer person. You just kind of got a slug to get them away from you. But if that's the case, then I try and like, you know, rebound and everything. Meaning let them pick themselves up or whatever. Mm, I'm gonna go for the box first. Two times on this map though in a row. Or, like I said, with also the Mori is, um, I wish it was, like, an option as well. Like, you could still push for it. Because not always do I want to Mori someone. Now you 
I mean, I bring a Mori if I want to Mori someone, obviously. Which I don't bring often because I usually don't get to that point. I would become a killer. That would probably be what I would do. I probably wouldn't put down the game. I would just stop playing Survivor. <laughs> I'd be like, nope, no more Survivor for me. Main. I'm a killer main now, which would help me to put the game down a little bit. Because I don't, um, I can get anxious playing killer. But it would definitely want make me want to play it more. Oops, somebody got him. And I don't mind playing killer. I really don't. But I do get anxious. But this game just has that special place in my heart. It's so much fun to play. It's so much fun to connect with everyone who plays it. It's fun to meet new people. And yeah, you get toxicity. It'll it'll happen no matter what you're doing. I mean, you could probably play a game that wasn't online. You'll get some ass hat coming into your chat to say something mean to you for no good reason. Because they're just an angry person in life. But DVD will always just have a special place for me because it's really helped me enjoy enjoy streaming more but it hasn't helped me enjoy streaming more because sometimes when it comes to variety I have no idea what I want to play I'll have no idea when it comes to a variety game like what do I want to play today you know from my great height though. Oh, never mind. David's got the box. Where's the boon? Oh freaking over there. Alright. I pass a gen on my way, I will probably pop on it, but I'm gonna try to get over to this boon. Please be circle of healing. Yes! Nothing's more sad when you get to a boon and it's not circle of healing. <laughs> By being honest, I hate getting to a boon and it's not that. My face got barbecue. Oh no, Elodie! I'll be right there! I was looking at the, I can't find a frickin' gen. Just the box over there. Alright, that's fine. Wait, not, did I say LOD? That was last game, sorry. Bang. My mind is still in the last game. <laughs> breakdown, let's go. I like breakdown. Go. I think you went right. Yeah, you went right back for right after though. I was able to block her for a second. No. Opened it. 
I did. I yeah, did. hi! You're across the map, though, so they're gonna get her off the hook, hopefully. No, they didn't go for her as, as I was being carried. Oh well. Oh well. But to go back on this Mori thing really quick, I love being Mori though. I do. But I like it as a special event thing. You know what I mean? If it's like every game I'm being Mori, I'm gonna get tired of it. But I do like I like it because it is something special. Because me as killer, I don't run it very often, because I usually don't get to the point a lot to use it, and I don't want to waste my offerings if I'm not very good at it. Alright, no worries, Brad, no worries. Thank you for letting me know. This pinhead had it out for the fang, though. Poor girl. We did pick her up though. Let me do my Rubik's Cube real quick. Alright. Solved. I'm the best Rubik's Cube player in the world. Let me go see if I can pick up Fang. Thought he was gonna mori her too. Oh, you're just Look at everyone, okay. You're not playing very nice. You missed. You're not playing very nice, sir. You need to pick up people. Yeah, uh huh. You need to pick up. What are you doing? Oh, somebody got up. What are you gonna do about that, huh? Sir, you need to stop being an ass hat. Here, I'll I'll just heal right here. He is just like hitting people down and leaving them. I'm gonna heal myself so I've got some life. pick me up? You pick me up? I wonder if he's not picking them up because they're on death hook. But still, that's just rude. Just because they're on death hook doesn't mean you leave them on the ground. He's practice. He's pretty much right. Yeah, he's practicing for the Halloween event. My only guess was he didn't want to pick them up because they were on death hook, but that's not the way you play. It doesn't matter if they're on death hook. Just sadly, just hook them so we can move on. <laughs> or let us pick them up and then go for us. I don't know. At least um, I was able to get far enough away so that Jeff could pick them up. Did he actually finally take out that boon? Uh, I finally took out the boot, though. You summoned me. Alright, I know where the box about was, so he should be over there. That's my only guess, is he's just trying to, um... Get everyone hooked fairly. 
don't know. JW, hello! Oh, thank you so much for the head pass. Oh. Thank you so much for that. How's it going? How has everything been? Oh, okay. We'll do. We'll do. We'll have to play the happy birthday song here in a sec. I love playing my happy birthday song for everybody. Yeah, because see, now he's hooking the Fang. That's my only guess, was he's trying to get everybody to death hook before um, actually putting someone on death hook. ideal way of doing it, but okay. I'm not gonna do- sorry, I was trying to decide if I wanted to do that totem. I think the Fang might have had the boon. But I'm not sure if he snuffed it or if she had the boon. Frick, he's touching his box. It means he's gonna know where I'm at. <laughs> what? Sir! I was right behind you! I thought you would have heard me scream! Good. Oh, was out of state last week. Everything go good? You were safe, obviously, safe travels and everything. Okay, David's got the box, so I'm leaving. <laughs> this match is over. We're not getting these two guns done. He knows where I'm at, so I'm just gonna run. Oh, I'm stuck on a... There we go. Bye! Yep, he knew I was here. He just couldn't figure out where did I disappear to. Frick, every jet I'm around is done. What was that? Oh, that's my toolbox. I'll take this. Thank you, Brad, for giving GW a shout out. I only knew it was their birthday because, oh, because of their posts on Twitter. <laughs> I'll admit it. That's a lot of the time same. I only know sometimes because of Twitter or Facebook. Alright, you deserve this! He's like, damn it! Where does this Kate keep going over here? This is the second time I've lost him in the lockers over here. <laughs> Dinner has been consumed. Elfie has been nourished. My meds have been taken. Got dizzy. Oh no, I'm petting Elfie. So I'm not going to go just lay down and watch stream. Sounds good. Take a rest, SK. I'm glad dinner was consumed. I'm glad everything else was good. I just hope that you can, the dizzy spells stop and you can get all better. But yes, definitely sit down, relax, and enjoy. Send me into the middle of nowhere, Wisconsin. Fud. I'm gonna see if I can find Hatch. 
I doubt I can. Because I'm injured and now... He's around. My best bet is... Shaq! Nope, it's not near Shaq. Damn. No, sir! Sir! <laughs> sir, Hatch is over here, isn't it? Let's go with me. Let's go with me. You want to keep me, but I don't want to stay. Let's go! I don't want to stay! I want to be a free Kate! No, oh my god! <laughs> yes! I ran the right way! <laughs> Damn, you can tell he panicked there at the end when I found it. He panicked because he swung. GGWP. I'll admit that had me, uh. That had me nervous there for a sec. Ah, I, I'm not gonna say that. That sounds weird. I'm just not gonna. Oh, holy crap. I'll admit, I'll admit, whoo, I was sweating there for a second. I was sweating there for a second because I thought he had me. For sure, he had me. Work is almost over? Good, 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 good. The one birthday I will never forget. Oh, it's Shadows, who's my birthday bunny. Those are the best ones to remember, right? The birthday buddies. Oh, oh, Oktoberfest, let's go. Hatch, I cannot believe I freaking found it. I was just running for my life, and then I heard it all of a sudden, and I just was hoping I could get there before he hit me. Because I knew he probably heard it at the same time. But damn! That was like, that had my bunt clit- my, my bunt. <laughs> my butt was clinched and everything. Because I don't- I don't know, I think he was trying to use his chains instead of hitting me down, which he probably could have hit me down maybe once or twice farther back, but I don't know. I, I, I wasn't looking behind me. I am just happy. I'm sad though, because I have a freaking challenge here. I think it's this one. Escape one trial through hatch and I took it off a while back because I was having no luck. And now I escaped through hatch. I don't know where though this challenge I'm currently doing is. Here it is. So um, we're gonna go play killer. We're gonna go play hit pinhead because we just escaped. Let's go back to the current tome, or the last one, and see if there's anything. Break 25 pallets. We'll do that. We want to clean up. All right. Whew. That one, that one had me sweating, because I really got nervous when I heard it. I always get hatch. I ne well, I should say I never get hatch. It's, it's more rare for me, because it's either I don't get to the end, or... Um, I just get unlucky and I'm on like on the opposite side of the map because when I am the last person left, I always check Shack because it's a very common place for it. And um, I never play offerings because I don't normally get there. But I had this challenge selected a, like a couple streams ago, not this one, but the hatch one, because I was going to try it. Like there was two matches I think I had where I was waiting for it and Killer found it first, um, which sucked, but it happened. So I'm like, you know what? I'm done. I don't feel like doing the hatch challenge and I'll come back to it. I knew I would get a hatch when I didn't have that challenge on. That was pure luck, though. All right, what I'm going to do real quick is I'm going to put my points into Dredge because he will be my last killer until I'm completely done with getting all killers to at least level one. Hysteria, let's go get Gift of Pain. But, I mean, still, GG's to that killer. I mean, that was a fun match. 
I only just don't understand why they were leaving us down on the ground at that one point. My only guess is, is because those two people who were down were on death hook and he was just trying to make sure like everybody was on death hook before someone died. That's my only guess. Because right after that, after he got me and um, I think it was the Jeff on our death hook then he killed the other people so that's my only thing i'm known as the hatch whisperer in my swift groups that's not a bad name to have that's not i wish i could find hatch more because i think it's a fun way to escape <laughs> i just think it's fun to find opening the gate sometimes especially if you're the last killer or killer you're the last survivor. It's a little boring. Waiting for the stupid hatch to open or door to open. But I wish I had hatch, hatch luck like that. Only once, too, that I can remember. And I think I. I think I clipped it. Um, was I lucky and I had Hatch literally spawn in front of me while hiding in a locker? I love that. I love when that happens. All right, Dredge is done. Every single one of my killers is at least level one. And now we can go and play um, Pinhead, and then we can put points into random people now. Because I really... I don't care where my points are, but I do need to put some into Kate today, because I'm getting low. But we're going to go play as Pinhead real quick, because we survived, luckily. Ooh, I was playing a toxic game last time. I was playing with Light Blue. Waken Awareness, Call of Brian. Um... Lightborn, I only stick on in case um, there's too many flashlights. So my last perk is always kind of like a toss-up of what I want to do. I've been using Devour recently for fun. I've also used Bamboozle recently kind of for fun, too, because... um. It's helped me with chases, but I don't think it helps with Pinhead. I'm up at Starstruck on. Increase maximum. I don't. <laughs> I've practiced with these things, but I'm really bad at it. We'll just use these. I don't know. Not the greatest of Pinhead players, for sure, but he's got actually fun to play. In two weeks, when 6.3 comes out, a lot of people will get two extra prestige levels, will you? For what? I'll be honest, I have not paid much attention to anything about 6.3. Because after the uh, all the information about the Mori and system and everything, I just stopped paying attention. I didn't participate in the PTB itself, so I have no idea anything that's coming out with it. Hello, Zadia! Corny joke. I was reading a book about the history of glue. Now it's stuck in my head. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice joke. <laughs> First time I opened DVD in a long time, I opened it last night to be Magic's Killer, but never got in. No. Try and do the whole snipe. No, not snipe killer, but get an S killer. Nice. I didn't play DBD this weekend. I didn't feel like playing. Normally off stream I play just killer because I'm more relaxed as killer off stream. I get a little anxious for some reason. I still do get anxious off stream as well, but I can get very anxious playing killer. And a couple weeks ago I played Pinhead a few times. I, I had a couple games with him. I'm not really, I don't like the chains and I'm not very good at them anyway. I just kind of like the box mechanic being able like my favorite thing about killers in this game for me when I'm playing killer is I love being able to transport to an area fast 
So, Freddy, um, Freddy's is probably my least favorite. Sadako's, um, Dredge being able to transport to lockers and everything across the map. Love that. Pinhead, you can only do it when your box is touched, obviously, so it's a little more random or whatever, but I do like being able to teleport. Oh, all part of the prestige rework. If you had anybody at level 50, they get... Oh, okay, okay, cool. Yeah, like I said, I haven't paid attention to anything with this upcoming mid-chapter. Only, like I said, because it's just after... Ugh, what do y'all got medkits for? After the whole Mori system was um, in the mid-chapter PTB, it's not coming out. I stopped paying attention because I did not care anymore. No, no, no. The Mori is not going to be in the next update. They said it was just going to be in PTB to get feedback, and it would be a much later update. I'm just saying that because of it was in the PTB, I didn't pay attention to anything mid-chapter. Sadly, it kind of took over because of its negativity and everything. But for sure, it, it's it, the Mori thing is not coming out this mid-chapter. Is the Unbreakable thing going into effect though mid-chapter? I know it was in the PTV, but it got so buried because of everything else. Maria's favorite killer. Oh, she hates Pinhead. I... I don't dislike him as much as I used to. I don't necessarily like running against him a lot of the time, because sometimes um, if you're not playing in a Swift, especially, and nobody's touching the box, it's a very annoying to play against, but... I used to hate him because he scared the crap out of me because I didn't like his look, but I've gotten used to it. Hi! Kaku, how's it going? Thank you so much for giving myself a shout out, Magic. <laughs> I'm not 100%. No, they, they said they will not have that come out. The Mori system will not come out this next update. They said that for sure. I saw that there and it looked like a little like figurine of her. They said they'd put it in the PTV, but they would like, not release it like, in anytime soon. Head, I was like, oh, look at that over there. And then all of a sudden it moved. Ooh, they didn't like that. And they didn't have a specific date. They just said, no, no, no time soon. We out. I saw Jake back there, but damn. Ah! <laughs> no trees for recovery this time. I'm stuck on a wall. I was trying to take a shortcut and I missed up. Missed up, messed up. <laughs> Not the boon. Why? You summoned me. I'll break chase for this just cause. I came. We walking toward before. Nice! Head on! It was applied directly to my forehead. You could only do it once, though. Mm-hmm. Okay, I see where everybody is. They could be starstruck as well? I don't know where they went though. Oh no! I got stuck on the stupid beds! Well, my starstruck is over. No, it's not. Pre 
throwing pallets for? It tells me where you're at. I'm in the middle of the chase. You can have that. A Kate was boiled over. Wow. Who would have guessed? Thank you for giving Rakaku a shout out, Magic. Uh, I'm gonna let him go just because, I mean, I lost him anyway, but I already hooked him anyway. I would rather try and get everyone to one hook. challenge so I think I will when I run into him now I'll break him hello I'm standing in front of you No, I saw you in there, Quentin, but I've already hooked you. Throw the pallet. Thank you. I need to find those pallets I uh, didn't break with Kate. Here they are. Thank you. this Nia. Actually, this will help. Ooh, yes, the dead hard. She wasted her dead hard, so I know she doesn't have it anymore. Damn, I just cannot catch this girl. Got her. Yeah, I see you through the wall. Probably won't be able to find him because he'll probably leave. Yeah, he left, so I don't know where he went. That's okay, they can get her. Thank you, I'll probably get my challenge done. hook yet? Oh, nope. I, I don't think I've hooked Jake yet, which is kind of against what I want to do here. I would rather hook him before her second, but I'm starting to lose my bat or my let's go put you over here. I'm starting to lose Fine, if you want to go this way so bad. The box. You opened it. I came.
Knew we had dead heart, but I got rid of it. That's my title of my stream. As I freaking hate dead heart as killer now. Damn. Go ahead! I need this pallet anyway, so I'd rather stand here, get blinded, and take out the pallet. But I titled my stream, I freaking hate dead heart as... No, he's in one of these lockers. I'm gonna let him be in that locker. Uh-huh. You have dead hard and head on. Oh, so that probably means he was exhausted. Cause, um, I think he had used dead hard. Oh, there's a boon around. I can't either find Jeff or keep a, or hit him. Not Jeff, sorry, Jake. Oh my god, it's a Jake. Look like Jeff. Just passing through, sorry. How long has it been a Jake in this match and I've been calling him Jeff? Okay, I'm not going after her, because I know she's on death hook. Oh. Jake, I'm so sorry that I've been calling you Jeff this entire time. That is completely 100% my bad. Ah, I should have gone through there. <laughs> Touching my box. Yeah. Some people. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, see, I never use his chains, because really, I just don't want to. I don't like him. Was that his first hook? Yes. What do we got for gens? Middle and this one. Which they are not touching. I don't want the quitting anyway, so. Ah! Y'all touch my box at the most inappropriate time. Ah, thank you. Probably gonna get this Jed done, or the last Jed done since I'm gonna chase. Ow! Wasn't even near the pallet! And no offense to this Kate, if I see her, I might take her out. Because we're getting to that point of the match where I'm gonna need to throw it into my balance. This girl loves to pallet, or to vault, I mean.
Nope, he's in that locker. So I'm gonna let him be. No, you can open my box. If I can get this kill. I'll kind of throw the match a little bit into my favor, but not much. It's a little late. What a waste of good suffering. It's a little late. I'll tear your soul. Where's that pallet? Here we go. Um, I really don't know if they're working on another gen. No, I really don't know what everybody's doing. There's only one gen being worked on. What are y'all making noise? You touch him, my gen? Don't touch my gen. I'll go around the locker. <laughs> This person, I think, has lightweight. Oh, I think it's Quentin. I think he's in his locker. Mm, about ninety-five percent sure it's Quentin, and he's in that locker right there. Yo, what are you doing? There's three gems, and you're only working on one. You all like hiding in the locker somewhere? It's kind of an easy three gen. The box. You opened it. I came. Not the Nia. Oh, good. The Jake Jeff. I need to go after him. Oh, good one. Good one. Good one. Yep, the pallets. Love to see it. However, I can go around. Yeah, I must be going now. I got pallets to break. All right, I don't know which gen it was, and we got a little far away from him, so we'll probably finish that one. Is it this gen? Yeah, there's the Nia. Hmm. I'm not even gonna bother looking at the other two gens. I don't think they're working on him. I'm just gonna go and see. Uh, here's Quentin. His death hook. Oops. Oh, I shouldn't say oops. Man, I've turned this match around. But I, I am actually just gonna blame them. 
Because I really don't think they've touched the other two gens. I've just guarded this one gen. I haven't even checked on these two over here. No, nope, that one's not touched. And that one's not touched. I've guarded one gen this entire end of the match. Who's making all this noise over here? Snap. Stop. Do you have DS? Nope. I'll tear your soul apart. Alright, I'm gonna hang out right here. If she gets hatched, she gets hatched. It's all good. I thought they played a pretty good game. Just like I said, working on only one of the three gens is a little rough for them. Oh, good. She got it. Because I didn't have to guard anything. I just guarded the one gen, and that's all I had to do. And thank you all for dropping so many pallets. I got my challenge done. But that was fun. See, that's what I mean. I like playing Pinhead. It's a lot of fun to play. I double piffed for that. Let's go, Silver. Um, but I like playing him. I just don't really like using his chains because it's just not very fun to me to use. So I just don't. And then I kind of rely on the box. And then if they get it, they get it. If they don't, they don't. It's whatever. But that was a fun match. I liked that. So sorry, Jake. I called you Jeff the entire time. Not what I meant to call you. I swear. It looked like he had, like, Jeff's really long hair. But I must have just... Every time he was running away from me, I just missaw. Molly! Hello! Welcome on in! I like that emote. <laughs> that is a cute emote. Were you in my last match? My chance? Oops, that's not what I wanted to click. All right, one killer challenge done from the past tome. Really, all I have left in um, 11 is um, just uh, twin stuff. Nah, well, there's a couple other things. God, I have a lot actually left of Survivor in this tome. Hide within 10 meters of the killer without being caught for 60 seconds. Oh, that's a single trial. No wonder I haven't done it. That was a frickin' single trial, not what I'm all about. Alright, well, let's move on and go back to our survivor. No, I just like, oh, okay, no, no worries, you can lurk away. That is totally fine, I just thought I'd ask. It just happened right after my match, that's why I was asking. Well, welcome on in nonetheless, I hope you've been enjoying your time here. And go, if anyone wants to lurk, it's all Gouda. If you want to be a lurker, I am 100% in support of that, because um, I myself am an enormous lurker, I love to lurk. I love to lurk. We're gonna spend a couple points on Kate here real quick because they just need some stuff. And then we'll get back to our survivor ways. But if you are new here, I do play a little bit of killer. I'm a survivor main, but when we survive against a killer, we go and play that killer we survived against. And, ooh, kinship. Uh, we survived against Pinhead, so I had to go play him. And I actually don't mind playing him. I kind of like to play... I kind of like to play Pithead. And that last match was a lot of fun. Like I said, I think the survivors kind of boned themselves because I don't know if they weren't working on gens or... Uh, I, I shouldn't say they weren't working on gens, but they were only working on the one gen. I didn't even bother to check the other ones. I was hoping to find... What do I got? <gasps> we don't have to play with Balanced anymore! Oh, wait, no. Do I? No, I finished. We don't have to play with Balanced anymore. Uh, let's just keep the hatch one on and see if we get lucky today. But I can take off Balance and put Head On back on. Oh, I meant to look what that Quentin was running. I think he had both Head On and Dead Hard, which are both exhaustion perks. And there was a couple times, I think, where he had used Dead Heart, but then got in a locker, and I shouldn't have worried about it, because he wouldn't have been able to use it, because he should have still been exhausted, but ow. Oh, dear. 
I didn't look. Lurking is amazing. I love lurking. Like, because most of the time if I'm watching streams, I'm actually doing things in the background. I, I, I like to, like, listen. It's, it's like, you know, if you listen to music in the background. I don't listen to music. I listen to my favorite streamers or my friends and everything. So I sit in their chats and I lurk because I like to have them on in the background. Or I've got, like, 20 streams up trying to support people <laughs> and I can't decide which one I want to be in. That's also a problem I have. I will literally have like 20 different tabs up of my favorite streamers or people I'm trying to support or my friends or whatever. And I can only have like maybe two on with the sound before it gets to be too many voices in my head. Or sometimes I just like to watch you play. Like I'm just say I have nothing to say. I just like to enjoy watching people play the game. Or whatever they're playing. Mainly DVD streamers, so I will admit. A lot of DVD streamers, but I do like to just sit back and enjoy watching them play the game. I just noticed there's an ad running, so let me stick that up in chat for you guys. Did I ever get food for the day? I don't think I did. Nachos with a bag of chips! Extra chips! Let's go! Except for with my nachos, I like extra cheese. But I'm okay with that. Extra chips. are enjoying the spoopy music it's actually more spoopier today with the ones that are coming up on what was it wednesday yeah friday we played lo-fi music because we were playing a chill game but on wednesday it, it wasn't as spoopy as i thought it was going to be but today's has got some good stuff as long as this station is free and i can use it during when pretzel rocks has it up i'll be using this hopefully all month And also, the shirt I'm wearing today on Friday, I wore a um, fairy version of a shirt just like this. If you actually want the credit for the shirt, it is currently up on my Twitter. I actually have, it's the same package that I posted uh, on Friday. This map, I've gotten this map like three times today. I've played three survivor matches, I think, and I've had, we're all Kate, I just realized, oh no. But I've had this match three times. I was trying to figure out what was going on behind me. Is there a gen in Killer Shack? Yeah, and that's totally fine. I will, like, sometimes I won't have my second screen on. Just no real reason. Just don't turn it on. I'm going to run them this way. Well, after I run into a thing. I was hoping to get around that corner before he did. But anyways, as I was saying before I <laughs> blight all of a sudden ended up behind me, is I don't always turn on my second screen, so I'll have like all my streams going on in the background behind my game or my program that I'm currently running. Normally, I'm either, like, working in Photoshop or some editing program, because that's something I just love to do. It's so relaxing to me 
to just edit things and make things like I was watching streams yesterday like I was actually watching streams because I was modding as well but I was watching streams yesterday and as I was sitting there I came up with this idea of something I want to change but I didn't do it because I didn't want to um sorry like scary I uh, didn't want to take my focus away from the screen yesterday He's gonna snuff that, yeah. Unfortunately, because we were hanging around it. But I am a 100% supporter of Lurkers. If you want to sit back, relax, watch stream, listen to stream, have me on in the background and muted, it's all good, because I do the same. If you got things to do, I always say you come first. I'm here just for the fun. I'm here to provide entertainment. I'm here for whatever. See where that other Kate went? Other Kate, run away. Oh no. I do not know which Kate is the booter. One of them boons. I'll probably go over there. First, I'm gonna see if she wants heals. She does. All right, <laughs> my ass is hanging out, but that's okay. You're on death hook. I'm not. All right, there you go. I need to be going for these saves because I am the only one who hasn't been hooked. I'm trying, Kate. Other Kate. You get lost. front of him there that he would just turn around and come for me nope 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 he went toward he went toward the other Kate I popped my gen my bad gonna have to give me a sign that says we'll stream for corn dogs <laughs> oh that sounds yummy Because we're working on the last gen. 
And if I survive, which I'm not counting my my jelly beans yet, but I haven't been hooked. We have to go play a blight game, and I am so bad at blight. He is such a fast boy. Try it, other Kate. Well, I was close enough to the exit gate there, so I fell out. Man, I feel bad. I tried to get her. I tried to get him to follow me and not her. But I guess because it was endgame collapse, I mean, he didn't have no deaths anyway, so. Must get a death! Must get a death! That is sometimes the killer's. Um, uh, ammo. But we have to go play Blight. That's gonna be fun. Which one? The boon. Oh no, there's two Kates with a boon. Never mind. So two of the Kates had a boon. Well, nonetheless, GG. It was still a fun game. I just, I tried, I tried, I tried to help that one Kate out right there at the end. I mean, I got hit, but I could have gone down, but I pretty much would have guessed that he would have just picked her up first, and then I probably would have still either survived or I would have just gone down again. Um, all right, let's go play a blight game. Yay! He is one I really don't like. Because I'm, I'm not about the speed. Oni and blight are probably two of the ones I dislike the most because they're so speedy. They're so speedy and I don't like it. Uh, what was I playing with last time? Oppression, ruin, gift of pain, pentimento. Ooh. Oh, okay. Well, let me get my at least my three. Oops. Uh, oh, eruption. I was trying to think of what it's called. Well, I also have, looks like, level one of all these. Yep. Um... You know, I'm just gonna keep Starstruck on. I'm kind of enjoying it. I don't know if it really works with Blight, though. I don't see why not. Because... I will attempt his rush action. Yeah, and I'll just use that. Just to give it a good old try, but it never works out. I think I've hit maybe a couple people with it. I have a Blight Challenge. Hit six survivors while performing the Lethal Rush. Oh, that's not gonna happen. I'm not playing with Dragon Scripts. So, uh, what's this one? Break eight walls or pallets with a lethal, ru lethal? lethal Rush as the Blight. Um, well... You know, I'll put it on. And if I happen to get a map with a lot of walls and I get a map with pallets that I can just do that with, I, I probably will just stop going for people. 
and try and break walls and palace with my lethal rush just to get the challenge done with. Um, do I have any dailies? No, I only have dailies at Sadako, Dust Slinger, and Spirit. All right, let's give it a good old try. I don't know if I have any spoopy, um, we have this one, but I don't like that one at the killer charm. I don't really have any Halloween charms other than, you know, the saw ones are Halloween-ish, I guess. Mm, I'll just leave my charms on. My survivors, I'll put all my Halloween ones on. I am so sad that I wasn't around when they had that pumpkin one come out that I see people have. Because I want that pumpkin charm. I don't know when it came out, but it's been a while. Because most of the people I see who have it um, are people who've played the game quite a while. Welcome back, Magic! It's a little hard to do. The, uh... Ooh, what's that? The Lethal Rush. Oh! Okay. Am I still on? Okay, I'm still on, so it's dead by daylight. Um, the lethal rush and everything with the pallets and breakable walls. Is that what you're talking about? Alright, Dead by Daylight's gone down. We'll give it a second or so. I, I, I don't- good, I barely ever play Blight. Like, I just don't like the speedy- Anybody that's speedy or sneaky? It's Steam? Oh, okay, it's Steam. Okay, we'll give it a second or so. Wait for Steam to come back. Oh, it clicked you out of Conan as well? Okay, so yeah. Steam, it's not even Tuesday! But I figure since I'm playing Blight, I'll just put it on and see if I happen to happen to do it. I've never really tried to break pallets as Blight with, um... Or, excuse me, I've never tried to break pallets as Blight using his lethal rush. I've never tried to do doors or anything. Why not put a challenge on and try and see if we can get it? Get some. We'll get some practice in too. They'll give us some practice because, like I said, I, I never really play Blight anyway. I and mean, usually, if I know the game's not going my way, I will just start rushing around the map just for funsies. Not the Reese's penis clip. Rush back up, then rush and swing. Oh, at the same time to break them. Oof. All right. Well, we'll see how this goes. That's a lot of, that's a lot, a lot of actions. Oh no, Brad. <laughs> oh no. Dead by daylight. Let's see if it reconnects. I might have to, I might have to X out of the game and restart Steam. I've had to have do that before when they've had it down for a sec. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I need to go ask my mom a question about dinner. So since we're kind of at a lull at the moment, I will put the be right back screen up and I'll just be right back while we wait. Um, and I need to go ask her something anyway. I was gonna do it around like five o'clock, but I'll go do that now since we have nothing to do at the moment. So uh, I'll put my be right back screen up. If my mods wanna run some shout out clips for some entertainment, they may and I'll be back. And hopefully when I come back, Dead by Daylight or Steam will be all restored. So I'll be back in a few moments.
You're so close. Can I, I lift you up? Ow. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I'm stuck in We're stuck in this ungodly position. I can't. Can you stop smelling my food? <laughs> I'm really thirsty, though, and my drink is just sitting there staring at me. Oh my god, that was hilarious. I'm a... No, I can't. I can't see. <laughs> Okay, I got this. I can't see my eyes. <laughs> Come on, the bridge of my head is like a. <laughs> my eyes are water. <laughs> Come on, Come on. Okay, I got this. <laughs> Pumpkins in there laughing. The blind leading the blind, pretty much. <laughs> I am back trying to see if it's Extended coming line. back. Level three. Hello, the Yeti. How's it going? Welcome on into Skeleton. Yeah, I'm just currently. Yeah, I just went and took a break real quick since Steam the went down. Looks like it's back. Thank you to my mod so much for all the shoutouts, and thank you so much to the Yeti for the raid. Sorry, I didn't realize it was a raid. Welcome on in, raiders. Let me go over here. My bad. I had to scroll up. But thank you so much for the raid, the Yeti. How was your stream? Uh, playing some Dead by Daylight. Ooh. How was the how was the time oh, in the fog? Jesus, there was a train. Stream is hey, hope stream has been fun. Stream has been yeah. a lot of fun. Um, stream has been a lot uh, of fun. Thank you, Brad, so much for posting what that. What happened? I do have a raid video for you guys. I just, just one sec. What just happened for real? Let me just get my get my bearings here as I sit down. Or sit back down. You yeah, Steam went down me? while we were in the middle of playing Dead and by Daylight, so I took a quick I break to ask about dinner and stuff like that. So. But thank you class. again, the Yeti, so much for uh, the raid and bringing your community over. I appreciate no. that. I hope you had this lots of fun on your way. stream and in the fog today. I'm going to wait for the clip to finish, and then I will play my raid video for Boom. you guys. Boom. Looks Boom. like st uh, Steam is back as well, so Let's I'll set go. up my game again. Nice. Let's go. <laughs> Was oh a lot of fun. God, Thank dude, you. Wow. Nice and relaxing. Good. That's Always good to hear. How's your game been? Pretty good. Pretty good. I've had a lot of fun in the fog. Haven't had any really issues today other than just about right there with Steam, but you know, it happens. That's what we what we get for having internet, right? Or not internet, but Let me see how many do we have? Oh my Okay, we've got a couple more shoutouts. I'm gonna let the shoutout clips roll and then I we will play blank. the raid video. <laughs> yeah, games have been good. We're actually getting ready to go play a killer match because the way we play here on stream is I play survivor till I survive. Then we go and play um, as killer and we survived against Blight right before Steam took a dump on us. And um, I had everything set up. It just crashed while we were waiting for our lobby, so. apologize that my shout out clips sometimes freeze i cannot get that to not do that no matter what program i use they always freeze <laughs> interesting way to play it is it's actually a lot of fun i like to play killer um i don't i mean well i should say this way i prefer to play survivor survivor's just more fun to me but i don't mind playing killer and it it makes me play killer more and it helps me to get practice because i don't play it off stream extremely a lot i mean i do here and there um but it also makes me play killers i don't like playing and this is one of them so i have to go play blight because we survived this is and I'm the worst Blight player ever. I don't like to rush. I'm really bad at it <laughs> and everything. But you know what? It's like I, I survived. That's I don't want to say that's what I get for surviving. But it's just a kind of a fun way to play. It kind of switches it up. And it helps me to play killer a little bit more. And then, you know, sometimes 
like with Blight, for instance, I don't get to play them a lot anyway because I don't come across a lot of Blights, but, you know, it, it's a fun way to play because it keeps it interesting and then it also gets me off a of Survivor and goes place killer for a match or so and all that, so. I feel you on that. I suck at Blight and Billy. Same. Same. Billy, too. I'm really bad at fast killers, so Blight, Billy, um, Oni, I suck at, and then um, I can Nurse can be a speed as well because of the precise in her. It's not really speed, but you know, her blink. So, yeah, I'm a very bad blight. In this next match, as soon as we get into it, I rarely will use the rush. Um, mainly, I'll just try and hit survivors. And then if the match is getting away from me, then I start using my rush to kind of get some practice. But normally, you won't see me use it. <laughs> I'm really bad with it. And I should practice, but I don't play him enough anyway, even the way I play. Even if I survived against him, I rarely get him in my matches anyway, so I don't get to practice a lot anyway. But thank you again, the Yeti, so much for the raid. Here is a raid video for you guys to show you a little bit of what you can expect here on my channel. Um, to introduce myself, actually, my name is Scarlet. I'm a Dead by Daylight streamer. I play Dead by Daylight on Mondays and Wednesdays, and then Fridays are reserved for variety when it comes to anything from cutesy to creepy through october i'm gonna try and play creepy spoopy games so that is what will be happening on fridays um through october uh but the video you're about to see is going to be in all of dead by daylight because it's my main and i'll show you guys a little bit of what you can expect to see when you hang out here in skelly town here there's my Y'all see, Dead by Daylight just showed off my ass. Please be a toolbox. Please be a toolbox. Let's go, it's a toolbox. Oh, you can have that, that's empty. <laughs> Don't you dare come out of this locker. <laughs> Whatever the hell you are, creature. <gasps> Wraith, please be nice. Please be nice. Please be nice. Please be nice. Oh, oh my god. No! Please! Oh, you a hole! <laughs> oh my god, my ass. It hurts so bad. My ass hurts.
and Yeti so much for the raid and sharing your community with me. I hope you guys enjoyed the raid video. That's a little bit of what you can expect to see here in Skelly Town. A lot of me screaming. I yell a lot. I tend to yell a lot, and I do apologize for that, but I do scream a lot, and I do, like you see, as you could see, play some killer and get extremely excited over the littlest of things. And as someone pointed out, I apparently talk about ass a lot because I have three clips in it about it. <laughs> and I never even realized it until somebody pointed that out. But that is what you can expect to see here. Lots of screams, yes! <laughs> I do scream a lot in this game. I do. I tend to yell and I tend to scream a lot. So that is a little bit of what you can expect to see here. <laughs> and when I'm playing killer, I do tend to scream sometimes because survivors will scare me. I've had survivors scare the living hell out of me before. But I try it overall, like, in Dead by Daylight, have as much, as much fun as possible, you know, I try to make this game fun for everybody. I kind of have, like, the, the mindset that if you're gonna play Toxic with me, you know, if you're a survivor and I'm killer, I'm gonna hand it right back to you, you know, but I try and overall just have as much fun as possible at the end of the game. At the end of the day, it's just a game. So, we are all about having fun here, and you know what, like I said, if you're gonna be in the fog throwing toxicity at me, I'll throw it right back, but not very often do I. I try not to do that a lot. Ain't nothing wrong with the booty, though. No, nope, no, nope, not at all. Not at all. It's just funny that I didn't even realize I had three clips in there. About that. Because <laughs> I started, I, I like the start of the the video with my um, reaction to the spirit's ass on my screen. And then the clown one was, I was having a really, really rough match. And I was just getting my butt kicked. And so that's kind of why I was just sitting there talking about my ass hurting. And then the last one is when I play demo, I, we just call it the butthole. So mm, I don't want people touching my butthole. <laughs> I meant to get this lobby rolling before, while the stream or the video was playing and I got lost in the video. So we're currently playing. Oh, <laughs> everybody left. We're currently playing with Starstruck, Call of Bright, Eruption, and Awakened Awareness. These three are my perks Awakened Awareness, Eruption, Call of Bright. I'm kind of having some fun with um, Starstruck. I'm not very good with it. Like, I don't normally get a lot of hits down with it, but. I kind of stick that last perk on for fun. It could be light board if there's a bunch of flashlights. It could be um, just something fun. Devour hope if I'm in the mood for it. You know. But my main three are Awakened Awareness, Call of Brian, and Erup Eruption. Now, it used to be Oppression, but now it's Eruption. Flashing and bottles! Yeah! Oh, there's, yeah, there's also the clip about me talking about flashing, too. <laughs> See, it's all about having a good time. <laughs> we have a good time here in Skelly Town. Flashing, asses, blood holes, all that stuff. That's what we got here. Also, I know this is like very random all of a sudden. I was just thinking about it. I am going for a thousand follows by December 31st and or January 1st, however you want to put it. We are currently sitting at like 760 something. 768? I don't know, I missed the thingy roll by on my screen. But we're trying to hit a thousand followers by December 31st or at the end of the year. If I don't make it, it's all okay. It's all fine. But that is my goal. That is my ultimate goal for the year. And um, I have some new things planned for the beginning of the year. Uh, if you are a coffee supporter... There's a sneak peek up there, if you guys want to see it, um, but it's only for supporters right now. And I'll probably release a little bit more about it closer to the time. But that'll also, if I hit my goal as well, it'll be kind of a celebration in for that as well. But it'll happen nonetheless, even if I don't hit it. Where the hell she go? I think she's lightweight. Ah, but I lost everybody! I saw two people! And I have no idea where she went, but it's all okay.
if they're in a locker or standing by the pallet. Oh, good one. I thought you weren't going to throw it after I got you on the last one. Oh, I'm supposed to do my rush. Whoops. <laughs> oh, well. I'm supposed to do my rush action to get those, but I'm going to forget. Uh, nah, I'm not going to do this. CV Camp's palette, no. Uh, I am strictly an M1 killer, though. there and then I decided not to like I said I, I am not comfortable with my rush at all then I forgot I was supposed to do I was supposed to do on the rush action with this. Let me see. Oh, frick. I don't know how to even rush anymore. Wait a minute. I don't even know how to rush. I've even forgotten how to do that. Oh, well, I'll go see who this is. You can stun me with that. That's okay. I'll go after the Dwight again. Dwight, uh, David. You are a pain in my ass now, aren't you? Oops, I broke it again! Ah, this challenge is dead. <laughs> this challenge is already dead because I forget. See if she runs back upstairs. She did, but she did not do what I wanted her to do. Oh, uh, when you know when someone has your number. This Fang has my number. I pushed the wrong button. This Fang has 1-800 blight on her, uh, on our speed dial. If I can get him away from the gen. That'll work. I was listening, seeing if I heard anybody. What? I'm in a chase? Oh, I'm in a chase. Is this the David I've already hooked? nice, but you scared the living crap out of me. Oh, see what I mean? Survivors! They're scary! Like I said, I don't know if this is the David I've hooked.
Should have kicked this gen first. Yeah, because the fake, all she was going to do was going to flashbang me, but she didn't realize I was going to swing. Where's my gens? All of there, okay. Thank you so much, Yeti, for the lurk. And thank you again for the raid and sharing your community with me. I appreciate that. But I understand, after stream, take care of yourself. It always, always comes first. Remember that. Y'all gotta stop working on this gen. Stop. This is my gen. I have declared this is the gen of blight. Okay, no, I'm not gonna go for you. This is one over there. Cause I already went for you. But if y'all no. get together, I'm gonna forget to who's who. Actually, I'm gonna go kick this Jed. Yep, because I know they're just gonna constantly come back to it. Stop touching my Jed! Thank you, yes! <laughs> I love it when y'all throw a God Palette. Back to this Jen, see who's working on it. Oh, nobody. No, I got lost this time. <laughs> I have no idea where this David went. Um, so let's go check on some gens. Nope, somebody is here again. <laughs> Stop touching this gen! How many times do I have to tell you? Don't touch that one! I don't know. Are you the one I've already gone after? I don't think so. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Yeah, I've stopped doing that challenge because I know I'm not going to get it. Probably around with her flashbang. Or not. <laughs> Never mind. Thought she would have been. Um, let's see who returned to that gen. They're gonna finish that one up there. It is almost done. No. I don't suggest that. I'll put him over here by this door. It's all Gouda. Ain't gonna get no 4K, but that's okay. Did I? I never caught the... I never caught the, um... <laughs> I got one door. Like I said, I forgot to do it earlier, so I'm just gonna do it and let them escape. Two! I know I don't have any more. I'm gonna get three of the eight. <laughs> Oh, I opened this one, damn it. Wasn't there one over here? Yeah. Okay, uh, three. Oh well. Um, yeah, because I opened the one and then there's no more. I'm also not 
not one who likes to... Gonna go get some noms? No worries. Always take care of yourself after stream. Yes. And the noms are very important. Uh, I'm also not a killer who goes and sees everybody out the door. <laughs> I'll let them stand there and waste their time if they want, but... Not a bad game, not a bad game, not the greatest, but I'm also not a blight player, so... Not a blight player. But they did well. That freaking thing who flew out of the window scared the hell out of me. Who was that? Could have been the one that said GG's. Oh, no, the other one was an Ada. Sorry, I forgot. That's right, it was an Ada. Dang! Smack and release. That thing flew out of that window, scared the living hell out of me. But good luck, or good luck. Good job to them. That was uh, that was a fun match. Didn't use my rush. Did figure out I can do the, can do uh, the break of pallets, but I don't even know if um, let's see, there was four breakable walls. I don't know if they had thrown that many pallets, honestly, to break them for the challenge. But it is what it is. I thought I'd put it on to try it. And, um, didn't get it done, but that's okay. I actually did forget, though, like I said. It's such a habit to, like, when th pallets are thrown, to just automatically break them. Let's put some more points into Kate real quick. But I still had fun, and I hope all the survivors had fun, too. Like I said, they wouldn't stop touching my one gen. Ooh, we'll make it. I don't have that yet for her. Oh, I didn't want that. Too late. Too late. Oh, I collected it. Fire tap level two? Sure. Mm, didn't find any of the perks I'm running today, unfortunately, but that's okay. How far am I into perking her out? Oh, still got a while. I still got a while. I still don't. I don't even have level or page seven done yet. But that's gonna be my new- oops, I don't want that. That's gonna be my new, like, kinda rule, I guess. Um, I always keep about 100,000 in reserve, in case, for whatever reason, I need them. Um, oh, we're doing the hatch one. Strong button. Current tome, not that tome. Um, but how I'm gonna play with my blood points now, cause I don't- I don't really main anybody. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to kind of spend my blood points throughout the day on certain survivors we are currently playing with. So like, for instance, today we're going to put it into Kate because I don't have a lot for her. She's a little behind on my perks and everything. And um, we'll just spend them on the care unless I get a character that I've got a lot of stuff on, probably like Michaela, then I might go spend it on somebody else. But that is what I'm going to do. And I'll probably do it with killers as well. But all my killers should have a good stock of stuff, because I just went through and got every single one of them to Prestige 1. And, and I don't play killer often, so they should all have a good stock of add-ons and everything. But if I had to pick a main, it would still be Michaela, most likely. I do like Hattie. But I think Michaela will always be number one to me. She's just my vibe. And I know she's got at least prestige level four, so she's got a lot of stuff.
what's today? The 10th, or the 3rd. <laughs> the 10th? It's the 10th month. It's the 3rd. So we've got about 10 days till rank reset. So next week, uh, could be a little iffy, because we'll be right before it. And I'm not one who plays to make sure I always get to Yuri 1 or or whatever. I, whatever I get, I'm good with. I think I'm sitting at Silver 4 Killer, Silver 3 Survivor, which is actually how I like to do it. If I can get some killer games in, I like to kind of keep my ranks close to each other. Because I have OCD and all that good stuff. <laughs> I feel like I need to, but... Hey, we got a different map finally! I've played on that one all day. Also, you guys can see I got my spoopy charms on. For spoopy month. I don't like when it's so quiet so long. Oh, never mind. Blood flavor. No more. <laughs> Damn. Blood flavor, no more. Hello, Felix. Let me see if we can commit to this Shen. Yes, let's go. Ooh, two! A Death Slinger. On my way, Jill! Dwight's gonna beat me, but that's okay. We can get the heels in. Probably better to be over here anyways and do some gens since we popped two over there. Jill is all over it. Oh, on top of the hill. Oh, what the hell? Sure. Playing with perks like that. Come on now. Okay, I'll distract him. This way. This way. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I'll distract him. Didn't even notice me. All right, I'm on me way. Never mind. You've been he oh, you've been healed. You've been saved. this gen though I think he's currently f focused never mind missed me I wanted to do a head-on stud right by the basement. Ah! 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 
Would you like heals? I don't think he wants heals. Maybe he does. I never know if they want heals. I'll take the hit for you though, for sure. Go. Franklin's! Well, my toolbox was dead, so it's all okay. Oh, Jill's right there. She's got this. Well, I guess I'll do this then. Well, good thing I got rid of my toolbox when I did, because he's got Franklin's and I would have lost it. I don't want to say he doesn't seem interested in me, but he doesn't seem interested in me. <laughs> I took the hit for that Felix just so that. Oh, yeah, that's right. He's got that perk. Lip hand resonance. Where? Way over there. Nice camp. Nice camping. Oh, please camp me because I actually have something new to put on screen if you do. <laughs> I have something new I added to stream. I don't think he is though. I think he left. Which is fine. Good. I'm glad. Yeah, he went for the Felix. I have this new thing for stream when killers camp me. Oh, she didn't follow. Okay. Poor Felix. I don't know why he added up on that poor Felix. Oh well, another camping trip, I guess. I'll show you guys my new thing. But no camping trip this time. The Slinger didn't want to go on a trip with us. I need to remember, though, if he does hook someone while I'm on this trend to get off. Because I think he has... Pain resonance. Oh no! Sir! No! No! You're not supposed to use your weapon on me! <gasps> Do I get to go on the hill? Alright! Now I can see everything. I can see everything. This is a pain resonance hook, too. I want everybody to see me. Let's go! Ooh, I almost missed that skill check. Hmm, I wonder where he went though. Oh, he's over there with Dwight. Yes, touch the chin. Yes! Good girl, good girl. Yes, let's do the gen. Let's do the gen. No, let's do the gen. Never mind, he's coming right back for me. Or not, never mind. Thought he was coming for me, sir. The 
This is my gen, and I want to do it. Aw, oh, frick. No, get off the gen. I couldn't get it to activate fast enough. But yes! Do I finish the gen? But it bought me some time. Or him some time, excuse me. Man, I was just trying to get my head on to activate, but I only have level one, so it's a little slow. And I was hoping to get that stun in on him and everything, because I haven't got one today! But it got it let Dwight finish the gen, so good. Got him to finish the gen, and I don't know if he got her off the hook, but I hope he did. Maybe it's not. Does head on activate the same speed? I thought it activated slower. Never mind. Maybe it doesn't. Never mind. I thought it took longer to activate. For three seconds. No, it takes the same amount of time, just the exhausted effect. Never mind! I'm just dumb. It's okay. It's okay. Hello, Walkin! How's it going? How are you doing today? Oop. I pushed a button on my other screen, sorry. <laughs> So it's the exhaustive sound effect that lasts. I thought it, it activated slower when it was only level one. Nonetheless, it's okay that it got everything done I wanted to, so I have no worries about it. Let's put that in. Oh, we could put a syringe in though. Oh, I, the only reason I did it, Brad, was because I was on the screen. <laughs> That's why I gave the shout out. I, I was on the screen already. Otherwise, I would have just waited, but I was already clicking over there because I was trying to get to something. So I was like, ah, oh, wow, well, I'm here. It's going good. Just chilling out for the evening. Nice, nice. How are games going? Not bad. Not bad. It's been some fun in the fog. Except for I've been ex extra dumb today. And I'm talking about like with my knowledge of the game. My brain hasn't been working with the knowledge of the game today. For some reason, I thought uh, head-on activated slower when it was level one, but it's not. It's the exhausted status effect, so wouldn't have mattered. Oh, no, it's totally fine, Brad. It's totally fine. Like I said, the only reason I did it was because I was on screen. I was clicking over to uh, click something else. You're all Gouda, and you're very welcome for the shout out. Oh, you said I got it. I was talking about the corn that pops. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you were trying to tell me about the shout out. <laughs> I was like, no, it's okay. I got it. It's okay. Well, did you get your corn that pops before it burned completely? Or you got like a little bit of a burnt, burnt popcorn? I feel you there. I had fog rain today. Hey, it's, I don't know what my problem is. Earlier, I couldn't figure out why my balance wasn't activated, activating, and it's because Fearmonger was in uh, a perk going on. I was like, oh. And then Denny told me that that's what happened. I was like, yeah, that's right. I knew that. But my brain was just like, no, no, no. I have balance. It should work all the time. <laughs> and then, like, right there, I don't. Actually, that one I didn't actually know. I didn't realize that head-on activates at the same speed. I thought it was slower. Um, I knew the exhaustion got less, but I thought it actually activated faster when you had a better level, but mm, no. It's always 3%, 3%, 3 seconds. 
No, Bert, I saved it. Good, 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 good. Gotta save that corn that pops for sure. Burnt, burnt popcorn can be good if it's not extremely burnt, but I'm not, I'm not big into it. I don't like my, I don't like my popcorn burnt. Yeah, there are just some days like my brain will just forget how to work. Today is one of them. Let's go down this way. Looking for some toes. Oh, jeez! Oh my God! Why? <laughs> Why did that scare me? I knew that happens. I think it was because I was looking for totems and singing, and then it just popped out of nowhere. Damn it! <gasps> Totem. It's been a lot of boon people today, though, so. <laughs> I don't know if it's a good idea to take out totems. Mm. Is it a stealth killer? Is that why I haven't heard him yet? No, I hear a faint heartbeat. Alright. Other than that, the fog has been wonderful today. I haven't had any issues. We haven't really come across anybody, you know, doing the things that they do in the fog sometimes. It's been a good day. We've got a couple killer matches in as well, which haven't gone well in the way of me playing, but I had to play a blight game as well. It's another death slinger. No freaking way. Got him. Bye. Oh, two gens popping. Let's go. Okay, let me get out of here. <laughs> Bill, Bill, over here. <laughs> I don't have to waste my med kit. Ah, oh, thank you. Where did Bill go? Frick, ma'am. <laughs> See ya. Woo! That you got lost long time ago. That's for you, Fig. You finally got me. Finally! I was trying to get to the pallet and hopefully do that again, but okay, okay, you got me. I feel bad. I thought that thing got way lost. <laughs> 
Like, I thought she was, like, on the other level by the time I started running them again. And unfortunately, she doubled back and went through the window I wanted, but it's all good. I don't care. I just thought she was way gone. Yes, let's go! We could heal here. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Jill says, follow me! Oh, you wanna do the shit? Gotcha. Oh, plaything. I know where it is. No. What? Godsmack has a new album coming out. I didn't know that. Go touch the bones. These are my bones. Don't know if I'm done fast enough though. Alright, Bill's gonna get there way before I can because I don't. I'm not upstairs! Uh, I'm kind of unsure where the gens are now, so I'm gonna just loop back around and hopefully help her out. I feel like I have to be like super quiet. Oh wait, I'm trying to be sneaky and I don't know why. Let's hope he doesn't have! Nope, he doesn't. Starstruck. Bad, sorry. Is this her death hook? Good. Good, it's not. I'm right here. Hopefully he'll take off and I can get her off the hook. Come back to over here, though. <laughs> there you go. Well, I guess I'll work on this chin.
So we're down to one. What about that? Oh, was it still? Was that plaything? I forget. I think it was plaything. <gasps> no, Bill. Oh yes, thank you. I will definitely check that out after stream. Oh frick, I forgot. Nice. I was trying to find a locker, but Fang scared me and I didn't want to... I didn't want him going after her. I've escaped him a couple times today with my lucky break quick and quiet, so... Dang, what was that for? He's after Jill. I can't figure since he hadn't come back yet. Thank you! No! Jill! Oh no, she's way over there. Alright, I'm on my way! I will probably not be able to make it. Way. I was hoping you'd come over this way. You keep getting me on this side, though. Nice, nice, nice. Damn. <laughs> Save yourself, Fang! He knew. He is a nowhere, even though I think I hit him earlier with my head on. That's why he's a nowhere. But I tried. There wasn't much in it else to do because I was already injured, so why not go for it? I believe in you, Fang. I believe in you. That was a fun match, though. That was the first time today I've got to use my head on effectively. I don't get to use it very much with, like, survi carrying survivors and stuff because I'm in solo queue, so it's hard to, like, get that communication through, but I still love just absolutely hitting this killer. Yeah, she's probably... She's a good runner, though, I've noticed. Other than that one time where we accidentally ran... Nice! Where we accidentally ran into each other. <laughs> He's like, screw this! I'm looking for Hatch. <laughs> oh, come on! This was good. Good. She doesn't want hatch. I don't think. Huh. I thought I heard him like hitting something. Oh well. I'm not gonna stick around. It could be a while. 
So, let's move on. Could be a while. I don't know what they're doing. I think, uh, uh Ghost Slinger. I think Death Slinger said no, thank you, and Fang wants to run him. Um, we'll keep this med kit for a while. Silver three. Let's see if we can get to silver. Well, we got two pips, but every time I say that, I end up having a bad day, uh, match. Oh, we can get rid of one of these. Let's get rid of the spirit one. With the dredge. Can do, can do. Won't do that probably on stream, but can do that one much better than the spirit one. Well, we got 200... 200,000 points. <laughs> oh, my, my goodness, excuse me. Welcome to my cat world, with magic. bitch. Magic has a cat? GG's I was wedding buckets with Deathslinger. Thank you so much for the follow low tier. Wanocha, am I saying that right? If I'm saying that incorrectly, you may you may correct me. Were you the last ghost slinger or the one before that one? Oh, you're the one now. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna give Fig the hatch. I was watching and then I figured she didn't like did she want hatch? So that's cause she wasn't looking for it. But I hope she gets it. I hope she gets it. You were you were doing well. You were doing really well. I was having a really fun time. <laughs> I was having a fun time. Yeah, I was watching there for a second while the thing was um, running with you, and then I saw you leave. And then she got, I think she got all like butt hurt. I think she kind of got butt hurt. She got it? Okay, good. Okay. I thought she was going to be one of those uh, survivors who just wants to run the killer and doesn't care about Hatch. But I'm glad she got it. She deserved it. You played very well as well. I had lots of fun. And I apologize for the head-on stun earlier. I love to do head-on. <laughs> I love to run the perk head-on, so. Have you played a lot of Death Slinger? Or... I'll do this, Jen. Are you newer to him or not? Because Deathslinger is, um, if you haven't played, like, a lot of shooter games offline, like me, Deathslinger's hard. Oops, just like... Do I know what today is? October 3rd. Mm-hmm, I do know what today is. It's October 3rd. <laughs> Other than that, no, I don't know what it is. <laughs> You want to main him? He is actually kind of fun, I will admit. I am just super bad at killers when it comes to aim. And my community knows this. Any game I play, and I have to aim, it ain't going well. Fred! Oh my gosh! Sweet Brad has resubscribed for 20 months. Holy crow, 20 months. 20 months, that's right. Uh, where? <laughs> sir, 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 you're not supposed to do that. I got a sub, but I have, I was paying attention. Holy crow, holy crow, 20 months. Thank you, Brad, so much for the 20 months. You are so amazing. And sorry, I screamed. But I didn't realize Legion was right there. Thank you again so much for the resub for 20 months. I appreciate that. And holy cow, though, 20 months already. Almost, we almost. Two years. We almost two years. I know that's not a sentence, sorry. <laughs> it's been almost two years. Well, I got that gen done, so I'm gonna stand right here. Heal myself. Oh no, did that person. Ow, did that person not. Mend. I'll be right there! Whoever's on hook! Never mind, somebody got you. 
But yeah, Death Slayer is a lot of fun. Like, if you get lots of practice in that, as him, people, like, can absolutely crush with him. Oh, sorry. Didn't realize he was injured. But my community knows I am not an aim. I, I, I'm just not an aimer. <laughs> I wouldn't want to, so I don't know why you would say that. You are amazing. I'm almost there! Whoever this is. Oh, it's a Lori. I remember now, yeah. And Lori, who did not mend. So she went down. Which, been there, done that. Mm, this is not good because we're all right here. That's fine. I don't know where the other girl is. Ah! You were supposed to get one! Oh no, did he already hit the other three? Oh, I'm a big dumb. Fine, you know what? You can have it. <laughs> hey, what was that for? Oh, it's a paying attention. I got better things to pay attention to than you at the moment, all right? <laughs> but again, Brad, thank you so much for that. I appreciate it. You are my- Winnie! Lori, no! Oh, this poor Lori, I don't think realizes how Legion works. This is the second time she's gone down. This is the second time the Lori's gone down and has not mended herself. Alright, thank you. Oh, let's all have a heal party. Oh, here, here. He doesn't want heals. I'll heal you. I don't want to save Lori. <laughs> Lori's gone down twice because she hasn't mended, and I don't want to save her. <laughs> That's mean, though. I think she's new at the game. That's just mean. Oh, she gave up on Hook. All right, bye. All right, thank you. I'm sorry, Lori. I didn't mean what I said. It just gets confusing to me sometimes when I get survivors in my matches that are new to the game. Who is he chasing? So I have over almost 800 hours in this game, so. Yeah, if you want me. <laughs> I'm Iron Maiden now, but it is worth it! Ah, I missed. Now your Iron Maiden's going to expire! And I got the hit on stun! Gotcha. Sorry, Jake. All right. Let's go. Four gens? Never mind. Three? Eh, I'm gonna run out of med kit. Am 
come on, roll it in. I'm in. Can I literally have like a sliver of life? Oh, go away. Go away, blood. Go. Shoo. 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 Okay. I know he has Iron Maiden, so this is going to be bad for me, but I've already injured, so it's okay. I am already injured, so it don't matter. I didn't even come for me anyway. Not you running them over here in a gen I'm trying to finish. Jeez. I'm just trying to finish the gen. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to finish this gem before I rescue you because I've got speed. I will mend. I've spent most of this match injured. Okay, let's see. Let's go down here. Oh, there is no... I mainly went down here for a box, but there's no box. Is basement here? No, nope, basement's not here either. Alright, strike three. Let's go. He's running over there, because somebody has wire tap. That gun's done. Holy crap. Oh, a box. Good. I need this. Please be a med kit. Med kit! It's a flashlight. Well, you know what? I hate flashlights because I'm bad at them, but I will give it a good old try. Have we three gen ourselves? Is that why he's hanging out at that gen? Oh, no. <laughs> Someone's literally just running around the gen. Okay. That's okay. I'm not going to get there for the flashlight save, unfortunately. Oh, it is that gen. I see. Who's got the lag? Yep, you can hit me because then I can leave! And you won't basement me. Why is- Why is it just mock- Or not mocking me, shadowing me. Chase 
It's me, not you! Sir! Sir! Oh, I'm stuck! Watch that dead heart there. Why isn't he picking her up? Oh, there he goes. Maybe he's just waiting. I'm so confused on what's going on! I had a little friend with me, though. I have no idea why she was just chasing me. <laughs> Maybe she was trying to take the hit for me, but... I have a look to spare, so I was gonna try and do the same for her, but I couldn't get behind her. That's okay, I wasted some time. She got up. Hi, Ada. This is my best friend, Ada. Would you like heals? No, I got you. You deserve this. You're my best friend. Alright, thank you. You're amazing. I had fun running with you. It was just because I was just confused. Alright, I know there's a gen in shack. This is also blinking. Is there a solo gen here? Yes, work on solo gen. Maybe if I can work on solo gen, it'll keep them distracted long enough. Him distracted long enough. Maidens, I can't do head on. I didn't mean to double vault that. Go ahead, hit me with your frenzy. Go ahead, hit me twice with your frenzy. What are you doing? What are you doing, sir? Sir, what are you doing? Oh, he's waiting for his frenzy, I think, to end. Well, I'm leaving. Toodles! That's what you get. Don't be, don't be hit me twice with that. Oh, if only I had adrenaline. All right, well, I lost him. I have no idea what he was doing, though. I thought he was waiting for his frenzy to... Oh, no, did he open gate? Oh, no. Did he open the gate? having fun in the end because uh, I wanted to. I don't know. But we escaped, so let's go! Ooh, we have to play Legion. I personally used to love playing Legion, but the last few times I've played, I haven't really enjoyed it because I've gotten, like, survivors who are a little bit newer, so the game kind of drags on when you use your frenzy too much. But we'll see, we'll see. Double pip, let's go! I don't double pip often. Nice! That was a fun match, though. That was fun. Who was that the killer? Yeah, that's who said GG. So we knew they had Iron Maiden. They also had Darkness Revealed, which is interesting for Um for a Legion. Dragon's Grip. Oh yeah, Dragon's Grip and Discordance is very popular. Alright, well that was fun. I had a blast. I feel bad for this Lori though. I don't think she knew how to run against um, a Legion. Cause she kept she, twice! 
She went down twice because she didn't mend. And then she died on hook, but I don't know if she gave up or what. I felt bad for her, though. Um, alright, so let's go play... I don't have Legion, right? Dredge, Dustlinger, Onrio, yeah. Alright, let's go play a... Uh, what you got? Oh, I can get... No, I don't... I know. Um, no. I don't want to do any points to them. So, I've changed out Oppression to Eruption. And my killer... Like, all my killer perks are about level 1. I don't have barely any perks in level 2, no matter who it is. Um, what's my challenge, though? Let's go find a challenge and see what perk we want to put on. Oh, they might have been doing this challenge, by the way. Hit a survivor suffering from the exposed status effect with your weapon two times while using Dragon's Grip. But I don't really feel like running that. I'll do that eventually. Why do we have, like, a night... A lullaby going right now? Um, let's... What's my other challenges? Um, I don't want to play with any exposed... Well, I could play with my Starstruck be uh, my exposed perk, but I, I don't think I will. I'm trying to see if I have any other ones I've been working on. No. So I think I'll just carry the survivor. Where was that? Carry the survivor over 150 meters. So let's put Iron Grasp on. So we can try and see if we can get to a little bit farther of a distance uh, while carrying them. This, this, this lullaby is making me tired now. Now I'm all sleepy. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do, but that's okay. What's the other thing we want to run with? Baby, why was why was that a thing? In the, well, that's a spoopy song. If put into the right situation, that's definitely a spoopy song. Here we go. Oh uh, no, we have a Twitch person. Oh no. Should we play against this Twitch person and embarrass ourselves? I say yes. <laughs> there are ten fangs, so we're going to embarrass ourselves in front of. A devour, I guess would be their name. Two A's and then devour. A A devour. Twitch TV. Well, good luck to them. It, I don't know. I get. I'm starting to get now get nervous as killer when I see people prestige quite a bit, because I know that they've played enough to put enough points into at least this one person. So now it makes me a little nervous. We have a 12 Ace, an 18 Yui, a 17 Michaela, and a 10 Fang. I mean, I'm more confident with my Legion, but I'm not that confident as Killer anyway. You will not have faith in yourself. You are good at this game. I can't be good at this game. It just depends. <laughs> I can be. Like, that last match, I thought I did pretty good. I don't know if it was just me. Loop and the Killer, or the Killer, I think at the end, kind of gave up, but... Still, I'll take it as a win for me. But it's just that killer thing.
something. I get nervous because, like, I don't want to, like, disappoint, you know? I don't want to disappoint people when I go in as killer because I want them to have fun. And I want to perform, like, you know, I want to do good. I want to perform well. I want to have a good performance and everything. And I don't want to have to, like, tunnel somebody because everybody else is being toxic. Who have we played today? We've played Pinhead, and who was our other one? Oh, Blight. Yeah, Blight. Did we play someone before that? I don't know. But the last few times I've played as Legion, I've had fun, but I've also feel like I've come across people who are a little newer, because I feel like I was not abusing my uh, Feral Frenzy, but I felt like I was using it too much and it was dragging the game on. So the last few times I remember playing as Legion, it was like, it was pretty good games, but I got bored and I had to stop using my Frenzy because I'm like, oh my god, I'm just like, I'm absolutely being a pain in the ass to these survivors, I need to stop. All right. I saw somebody. Oh no, there's no pa uh, there's no pallet there. Frick. Yeah. I got scored because I thought there was going to be a pallet there, and I backed up, and there wasn't. Get some gens kicked for eruption. He's not a pallet thrower. Now he's a pallet thrower. <laughs> Damn aces, I swear. I think this ace thinks I'm bad. Which I am. I can be. No idea, though, where the Yui would have gone. Yes, let's get rid of this then. I am like I am so over the dead hard. I'm so where. I am so over the freaking dead hard. Now that people know how to work it. Ah! Ow, sir. Awesome. I'm looking for the boon. Oh, there it is. I have to carry a survivor 150 meters, not one single survivor. And, um, I haven't even got one yet. <laughs> well, I know your dead heart's gone now. But you ran me for two joints. Good, good job. I 
could walk farther, but I don't want to. I'm losing gens. See, this is kind of a group I don't feel like Frenzy's going to benefit me much. Might slow him down, but... <laughs> Loving the life. Michaela's booning. I'm gonna go here in a sec, check out the boon. Let's go kick the boon! Cause it's the same boon! I wish I had shattered hope in this instance. Michaela, you gotta stop. Was that not her I heard? Heard her footy steps. All right, onward. That gen is dead. This gen's not being worked on. Scratch marks over here. Frickin' Michaela and her boon. Oh, here we go. Ah, damn. I just can feel the frenzy is not gonna be a thing for me this match, so I'm just not gonna use it. Actually, no, I'll let the boon go. I want to know where this Michaela is. You're home. Welcome home, magic. God, is it that time already? Damn. I didn't realize it was freaking that late already. But this Michaela, I have no idea where she is. She's over there just constantly booting. I've only been able to catch the ace. No, I caught the... <laughs> Got her. Uh, I was able to catch the one Yui for a sec, but... All right, let's run back over here, see if she's booning. She's got life. There she goes again, booting. God damn. When your only purpose in the match is the boon, it's kind of boring. Oh, what the hell? I told you I was gonna get my ass kicked this match. You could just look at a lobby sometime and know that your ass is gonna get kicked. Major thrill. 
Yeah, I give up. I've officially given up. I know I'm not gonna be able to catch anybody. All Michaela is doing is wondering about booting. So I'm gonna let them get a gen done. Yes. And then I'm gonna go open the door. I just, I knew I should have left the lobby because I knew I was gonna get my ass handed to me. But it's okay. It happens. It happens. Here we go. You may leave. Get out of my match. I want to go back and play Survivor. Is there any more breakable walls? Hmm, I think that's it. Oh, here's the boot. Get rid of this for some points. But I told you guys, I looked at the lobby and said, my ass is gonna get handed to me. I should back out. I didn't. All I say is never catch Yeah, after a while, though, you just know you're not going to get anything done. So it's like, what's the point of even really continuing? Not not continuing the match, but it's just like, let him go. It's like, fine. It's whatever. It's whatever. If I get him, I get him. If I don't, I don't. Danny, are you still here? Hey, I didn't de-pip. That is all that matters. I did not de-pip. Oh, I couldn't de-pip. <laughs> Never mind, I couldn't even de-pip. I was at the bottom anyway. So if I did de-pip, it would have mattered. I'm at the bottom of this level, but it's okay. Like I said, the reason, like, after a while, when there's, like, one gen left, it's like, ah, you know what? Let him go. Let him have fun. Let him get out. It's all good. It is what it is. Sometimes you get your butt handed to you in matches, and sometimes you can actually do really well. Where's my music? Music play. But I did one thing. I caught I caught that ace. I kind of wanted to catch the fang just because I was chased her so long, but I got tired of listening to the stupid boon go off. That is when I always wish I would have brought Shattered Hope just so that I could have taken out those boons. Because I got tired of listening to it. JJ from the Michaela, were you the booter? Damn you! <laughs> no. I got so tired of listening to the boon go off. I just like, oh my god, not again. <laughs> yeah, you guys were awesome. You guys kicked my butt. And it happens. It happens. Just wanted to come in and say that. You did well. GGC as well. Y'all did wonderful. I knew. I told, I told my chat before the match even started. When we got into our lobby, I was like, oh no. I just got this feeling I'm gonna get my butt handed to me in this match. It's just not gonna go my way. And I did. I did. You guys did awesome. Surprise I live. I usually do really bad against Legion. Oh, you did wonderful. I could not freaking catch you. Right there at the end. Um, right before I think the, the last gen popped and I was chasing you. I was just like, oh my god, I can't. I can't do it anymore. <laughs> I, it's over. It's over. Right above us. Not discrimination is favoritism here. There were two of you. Is that why there were so many boons going off? Oh my gosh! Like I don't mind boons. I don't really like it's their whatever. Cause I love them as survivor and as killer. It's like I'll just go kick them. It's whatever, you know. But then it's like all of a sudden it's like, oh my god, freaking Nether boon! What the? <laughs> I can't freaking like keep up with the boons, and it, it's part of the game. It's part of the game. You guys did really good. Oh, my shout-out clip got stuck again. Sorry. Sometimes it gets stuck. Thank you, Brad, for giving Devour a shout-out. Funny girl, no, it's racism. But yeah, you guys are good. It, it was a fun match, nonetheless. Like, I caught the ace... Not early, but I caught him, finally. And then I hit the Yui once. And I never saw her again. I could never find the Yui. Welcome to my world, bitch. Thank you so much for the follow, Devour, and welcome on into Skellytown. You did amazing. Have a great rest of your stream. Same to you! You guys all did amazing.
It's just one of those games where you guys outplayed me, and there's nothing I can say other than you guys did awesome. I mean, I am a survivor main, but I do play killer, so, you know, it's like, I've played Legion quite a bit, used to be one of my favorites to play, and I just knew also with my Frenzy, it's like, I don't think I'm going to be able to catch anybody with my Frenzy, I think it's just going to be more of a hindering for me than it is helping, so I just decided not to use it. We took turns booting! <laughs> No wonder! I thought it was just you, because it seems like you were always in the area. And so I know, like, during the match, I was like, What is this Michaela doing? Why is she only like, booting? But if there was two of you, then that makes sense. Oh, Westgren, we're starting out with the buggies. Great. Liliana! Liliana Vale, that is a beautiful name. Thank you so much for the follow as well. Welcome on into Skelly Town. And again, you guys, keep up the awesome work. You did amazing. I gotta get these buggies off me real quick, just a minute. Gotta get the bugs. This is the first Wesker match of the day. Shocking, actually. Hopefully he doesn't have Iron Maiden, because I want to do some hit on stuns. Freaking Starstruck! I should have guessed! Oopsie. All Weskers have Starstruck. Love the aesthetic, by the way. You're amazing. Well, thank you. Uh, and I will definitely check you out after stream. I have a little bit of attention disorder. Sometimes I can't, I can't do two things at once a lot of the time. <laughs> so I'll definitely give you a. Oh, I, never mind. I will not do this chat anymore. I will definitely give you a follow after stream. There you go. I don't know if we're going to get this heal in, because he'll probably loop right back for us. I'll take the hit, don't worry. No, go, 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 go. Missed! No! I'm stuck. You're stuck. We're all stuck. Oh. Thank you for the boost. He has no idea where I went. He has no idea where I went. And just like that, I got the achievement finally for hiding in a locker. <laughs> And now I come out. I freaking love this build. And if he would have come anywhere near me, I would have used my head on, but he did not. Oh no! The gen I wanted to go to is done. Okay. Start chat up here. Wait, was I just up here? Am I a big idiot? And was I just up here? It was. <laughs> I got lost. Okay, there's a gen right here though. I'll do this one. I got a big old lost. I'm sorry. You got this, Michaela. He's strictly trying to use, I think it's M2. Nice, 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 nice. Which I get, with Wesker I love using his M2. It's not gonna break off from her though, okay.
Yes, you can heal me now. I think we need to go on the other side, though. I don't know what gens over here. Besides, I think we finished all the gens over here, unfortunately. I haven't heard any boons go off, so I could probably take out some totems. Where? Oh, she's over there running, so let me go this way. Are the lights on in that house? Yes. Oh no, Michaela! Oh, he's got starstruck, so I need to stay far away. I'll give her credit, though, man. She ran in for a long time. I am Bush. You are safe. I didn't realize she was on second hook. When did she? Oh, she was hooked. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. There you go. I hope she didn't have a boon. She looked at me and then she's like, oh no. Oh no. She's taking out the boons. <laughs> I didn't think he was gonna see me there for a second. <laughs> I'm going to make you hit me. You're not going to throw me Swiss, oh, Swiss whiskers. I was trying to say daddy whiskers when it came out whiskers. Even though I do love to be thrown. But no. No, no, no. So as I was saying, I just got back here not long ago. Oh, no. Been a rough mental day for you. Has it been, Denny? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I hope you start feeling better soon, though. I know how that is. I know how that is. Uh oh, he's coming back. Shoot! Don't make me get out the marshmallows. Yes, hugs to Denny. I was having a bad mental day on Friday. I think it was after stream, which is kind of in my own head. And then I kind of took Saturday off a little bit, kind of refreshed. Thank you. Be free. See if he comes right back for me or not. Yes. And then he's like, where does she go? <laughs> and then I had all just done them, so I'm all happy with that. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna crawl out of the, I'm gonna go to pizza. Anybody want some? Pizza and looks like beer. That was funny though. Y'all do the jet, it's okay. You can leave me here, I'm good. Y'all do the jet. I'm just gonna chow on my pizza. 
I got me some beer. Not a big beer person, but if it's there, I guess I'll drink it. That may be me. Bleh. That may be me tomorrow. I just gonna exist, but depends on how I feel, I guess. Well, I hope you feel a bit better, Denny. I really do. I know. That, like I said, I do it too. I have those issues too, where it's like, that was kind of me on Friday. I was just like, and in my own head, kind of after stream, wasn't feeling like myself. And then Saturday, I kind of just chilled. I didn't really do much. Hi, Michaela. And just kind of had one of those days where you just try and exist and do your best. Owie. Well, always know, Denny, that we're here for you. And always the biggest of hugs to you. Thank you. Oh, I was going to do the head on, but I was exposed, so it didn't matter. I was exposed, so he, I made him pull me out of the locker instead of hit me. What the hell went off that caused us to be exposed all of a sudden? Was that an add-on? It went so fast, and I was trying to run away from him, I didn't notice. Take me for piece of beer. Well, there was some on that picnic table back there. I might have eaten it all, though, by the time Michaela got to me. I was kind of hungry. I feel bad that Michaela has to run all the way back and get me, though. <laughs> I thought I thought I could probably lose him for a sec, but I didn't. Sorry, Michaela. You are amazing, though, for running all this way. No, no, no. No, go ahead. I'm trying to heal myself. Holy crap. Oh, no. She died. She died on a hook. Nice, nice, nice. I want Michaela to live. Playtime, it's over. He has a he has an add-on that causes me to be exposed like that, but it's not really working in his favor. Cause every time he's used it, I die. I'm already injured. I just don't know what it is because I don't know Wesker's um add-ons very well. <gasps> Pepperoni pizza, let's go! With a side of fries. Ooh, damn, does that sound good? Yeah, I'm not much of a beer drinker either. Actually, I don't drink beer. I don't really drink at all. But you know, I guess if it was there and it was the only thing I had to drink, sure, but I I much rather have what Denny's having. Pizza with a side of fries. <gasps> Did she get hatch? Yo! Was she right there? Nice! So what is his add-ons that's causing that? Um, survivors start the trial infected with the Euro... I always can never say that an infection for some reason, but whatever. Uh, survivors suffer from the exposed status effect for 30 seconds. Oh, when reaching maximum infection. Okay, so that's what was doing it. So it didn't really matter, though, in the case right there for me, just because um, I was already injured. And usually with Wesker, I try and get the buggies off me anyways. So, the only reason it wasn't working in his favor there is because I was already injured, so. Destroys, yeah, I figured that one. Destroys pallets when colliding with them. That's actually a really cool add-on. Like I said, Wesker's still a little new to me. I don't know his add-ons very well. Terminus, Snow Way Out, Bamboozle, Starstruck? Oh, I didn't change my challenge! <laughs> I was trying to carry a survivor as a survivor. It's okay. I like sweet drinks mostly. Wine can... 
Wine can be nice sometimes, usually white. I just don't drink a lot of alcohol in general. I'm just not an alcohol person, but I agree. Sweet drinks are definitely the way to go for me as well. I love sweet drinks, but I'm just not much of an alcohol drinker. Like, I will drink sometimes, like, some specialty ones. Like, my dad has this one currently that's, like, Irish cream, but I can't remember what the alcohol it is itself. I'm just drawing a blank. That sounds absolutely tasty, and I've never tried it, though. But that's something I would drink. Something, like, with a really good, like, sweet flavor, though. But I'm not much of a drinker anyway, so I wouldn't... I don't, like, go seeking it. Oh, that's why we're trying to do hatch. Uh, let's just put some luck in the game, I guess. What do I got left of these? Let's save a couple of leaves. Let's put the, uh, syringe in. Hatch, yeah. Bailey's! Yes! Well, it, no, it is it is Bailey's, but... I can't remember, like, it's... The, the thing that my dad has, because he keeps telling me I need to try it, because he said, I think you would like it, and I just, like, it's not something I drink often, so I don't think about it. And then, it's, it's like Bailey's Irish Cream something, but I don't know, other than that, what it is. I don't drink a lot either. Sometimes when I'm with family or when a fancy glass. Or when I. Oh, when I fancy. <laughs> it's like when you're fancy? When I fancy a glass, but it's not often been months since I last had a drink. Kind of the same. It's kind of the same. Like, I don't really drink. I just always kind of made this uh, thing that I would never. But I have drank before, so it's not like I never ever touched a drop. But not normally. If I, if I go to, like, maybe like a. I don't go to parties ever, but a special occasion or something, I might have a little bit, but normally, like I said, I just don't, I don't go seeking out alcohol and I don't like go like at night think, hey, a nice glass of wine would be nice. It's just not my thing. Not my thing. Oh, is that all it's called? It's just Bailey's Irish Cream? I thought it had a special name to it. I have had the coffee creamer one with no liquor. I have had that. I have had that before because um, we used to buy it sometimes for work. Not the liquor part, but the coffee creamer one. And um, we used to have it at work for our coffee creamer. But I haven't had it in forever. Welcome back, Yeti. How game's been fun. We've had a lot of fun. The last match was really fun. Wesker was a lot of fun to play with, and I think I confused him a few times with my, uh, with my lucky break, so that was a lot of fun, but yeah, it's been quite fun in the fog today. I've had, I've had a blast. And welcome back. I hope you had good munchables earlier. One of my favorite things to drink, and I haven't drank it actually in quite a while, but it's um, butter, butter scotch schnapps. It's so amazing. It's so freaking amazing. I love it. But I haven't had it in so long, and mainly because I just haven't wanted to buy it, but also I just haven't. Haven't been craving it or anything, so I'm like, it's okay. I don't need it. And I don't. Oh, it's a freaking Huntress. First Huntress match of the day. When my when dad was a bartender, he used to help make shots, the most popular, but that was called the, the blowjob. I've heard of that. It's a shot you drink without hands. I've heard that before. <laughs> See, I'm just not like, I've never been a drinker. I've never been comfortable around people who drink or anything with it. It's just always made me super uncomfortable. And so I've never really been to bars. I've been to a few, but I didn't drink. And like the entire time I was kind of uncomfortable. I was with a friend. And we were kind of just hanging out. Like he wasn't drinking or anything. He was just doing his thing. 
thought we were there, and I was just like, I just, I can't. I'm just so uncomfortable. And ever since, not just that instance, but... Hey! I'm working on a gen! Quiet! Ever since, though, I've never, ever been comfortable around anybody who drinks. Yeah, didn't think she was going to do that. I'll be right there. I've got some speed. Make her regret not picking me up. Or not picking me up, but... No! Run her over here! Darn it. I could have head on Stunder. Walk by, walk by, walk by, walk by his locker. Oh, she's gonna hate me! She's gonna hate me! I'm sorry! Oh no! You know what? I deserve it. I deserve it. <laughs> I deserve it! But you know what? You didn't hook her twice! I've never been able to do that before. That was freaking awesome. Yas, butterscotch schnapps is so good. It's like dangerously good to me. That's why I don't buy it often because I could probably drink an entire bottle. Because it just tastes like a sweet drink. It doesn't taste like alcohol if you don't have a super strong one. But yeah, it's just like a, it's like a, just a sweet drink to me. You've never been a drinker also, but I know how to make drinks because of him. Oh yeah, I could understand that. Like if I had someone in my family like that, I probably would be the same. You're welcome. Bunch just over here so she can't hit us. Yeah, I'm not comfy around people who only drink with the sole purpose of getting drunk. Yes. It's just never been my same same. It's just, it's, I just, I don't understand it. Personally, like, with the sole purpose of to just get drunk for no good reason, I just don't understand why you would want to do that. But it, it's like personal preference though. It's like, if you want to, fine, go ahead. But I am not going to be sticking around, nor am I going to be doing anything without. I just get so uncomfortable. And even when people have drinking streams, I'm, I'm super uncomfortable even then. And I'm not even around the person. I don't know why, but. I get even uncomfortable when people have drinking streams. Normally I will lurk, but I will not pay attention because like, it bothers me. Blood splatter is red, luminal shines blue. I've watched enough crime shows. They'll never fight or ever, never find you. I totally need this on my shirt. <laughs> I like that, yes. How'd she not see me? I got you, Yoon. I got you. She might come right back for us, but I got you. I was gonna give her the syringe, but... I'm trying to get her attention so she'll stay away from her. Damn! She's good with her hatchet throws, though! But I wanted her to go for me so she would stay away from you, Jen. Oh, I got basemented for this. 
I am basemented for my sins. Because that's how people find the fun in alcohol. Yeah. I just like a drink because I want some. Yeah, exactly. Usually a glass with food or something. Yeah. And that's like the thing with like something really sweet is why I try not to drink it often. Because I, if it doesn't taste like alcohol and it just tastes like some sweet, like desserty like drink, then I'm like concerned with myself being like, oh, I'm going to really want to drink the whole bottle or whatever. So I usually will try not to buy it anyway. Thank you. No, you, you go ahead. I'll distract her. Yeah, go ahead. I got this. She hated me from the beginning of the game, I think. I want, I want Felix to live. Her sole purpose was to kind of tuttle people out a little bit, but she got a 3k, so good for her. Well, I very rarely drink one bed. Too my dad was an alcoholic, so I do limits. When I do drink, I stop at two drinks, no more than that. That's, I, I've never had, like, I don't have any specific reason why I'm this way. It's just kind of just a thing where it has made me uncomfortable in the past, and I've had friends who drank and have been in uncomfortable situations. So I've kind of just always just been like, I'm good. I will drink the sweet ones that are, like, desserty like and stuff. But even then, I try not to because I know being that it is like a dessert like drink, I, I would drink it all the time because it's just something, you know, fruity or whatever. Not fruity, but desserty, I mean. You have alcoholics in my family tree too on my dad's side and my mother's side. I think I've been lucky. I don't really have any alcoholics in my family. Like, I have family members who drink, but I would never consider them alcoholics by any means. But I feel like they drink too much but I also think I think that because I don't drink at all you know what I mean so it's hard to like judge for me I've only been drunk three times my entire life and one was not my fault someone spiked the drinks at a homecoming dance oh shit <laughs> that sucks but I know where I stand with alcohol and I don't over consume exactly that's the most important thing I've been drunk and I've, you've never been drunk is that what you're trying to say? I've never been drunk and I'm 32. Cause same. I've never ever had too much to drink. I've never been drunk in my life. I've had been like a little tipsy once and it was like New Year's Eve. I was having a really, really rough year. It was New Year's Eve. I was all by myself though. I wasn't anywhere. I was just by myself. <laughs> and I was like a little tipsy, but I went to sleep like probably, it, it put me to sleep. That's all it did. I got tired and I went to sleep. This Huntress's name was Ideal Pizza Rolls. I meant to say I haven't been drunk and I'm 32. That's what I figured. I figured that's what you meant. Because <laughs> that's why I said same, same. I'm 33 and I've never been drunk either. It's just like I said, personal preference, not my thing. I don't have anything against people who do it for fun. You know, if you want, go ahead, whatever, sure. Bloach boat, go for it. But I don't, I, I, I've had a friend who, who, it, he was having a rough time in his life as well, so I think that's what happened, but he did drink a little bit too much and got in some troubles, so, you know, it's, you know, if you want to do it, go ahead. I will support you and try and get you through it, but at the same time, I'm like, you kind of brought it on yourself. I hate to be mean like that, though, because that's just my feelings against it, so. Magic City PBJ with side of french fries? Oh, that sounds yummy. Oh, I could go for some PBJ. My syringe went to waste because I couldn't save anybody with it. Meaning I couldn't get anybody to use my syringe. Words are difficult. Yeah, I know. I know. Words are very difficult. <laughs> Whatever, I'm done. You're good, Denny. I understood ya. I understood ya. Both times, both times. <laughs> I know, words are hard. To, I, like, the other day I was writing something in someone's chat. And I don't know what I was writing. Let me see if I can remember. And I don't know why my brain or my fingers wrote this. Oh, I 
I was trying to write second season. We are talking about the Chucky show. And I was trying to write second season. And I wrote, like, second second for some reason. And I'm like, why the hell did I write second second? Or something like that. I'm like, I was trying to write second season. And I said it, like, twice. And I'm like, I don't know. I give up. Whatever. Because the person read it and they're like, second second? What? And I had to correct it. And I'm like, oh my god, I don't know why I said that. But it is it is whatever. Only time I drank at a bar, I was... I was too much. I was seeking Ice Ice Baby on stage and swinging... Oh no! Swinging on a stripper pole. Is that that combo? I have PBJ and... And french fries? I would too. I would eat that. That sounds good. I love... I mean, I'm, I'm guilty. I freaking love french fries. French fries is like the guilty food for me. That's... It's not like a meal. You can make it a meal, but it's not like always a meal for me where I'll just eat it as like a snack if I feel like making them. I'll pair it with anything. I can relate! I know! I don't know why! I don't know why when I'm typing sometimes. I will type like the most random of word and it's not even the word I want. And I, I do it quite often. And it's like, uh, I did it again, I think, like, in Blight's chat last night. I don't know what I said now. I just remembered the second second one, because I'm sitting here at my desk just like, I don't know why I said that. But I did it in Blight's chat last night as well. I said something, and I, like, put the absolute wrong word. And I have no idea how my brain even decided to type that word. That must have been a sight to behold. Right? I know. I kind of, I wish there was, like, film of this. Luckily, luckily, I've never ever had too much to drink in public, but I've also never had too much to drink in general. Like I said, one time I think I was a little, like, kind of tipsy because it was New Year's Eve, it was, I was by myself and I didn't really give a crap about the world kind of thing. Who, who, who's blinking me? Hi! And, um, it put me to sleep, <laughs> so... <laughs> I think if I actually had too much to drink, I would probably just fall asleep. What I always tell people, like, if you want to see me drunk... It's another demo. Uh, if you want to see me drunk... Ow! Sir... Damn it, I was trying to get out and I couldn't. Uh, you gotta get me super tired. I always kind of figured, like, if I'm super tired and I have not slept well and it's up and I'm getting, like, really loopy, that's how I kind of figure how I would be drunk. Because I used to have a freaking blast with friends when I was super tired, hadn't slept in a while, and had those loopy moments and everything. That is what I think I would be like drunk. Sorry, don't you come back for me. Get away from me. I don't want to heal because I want to stay injured. Oops. I'm sure I've been tipsy, honestly, but drunk, no. Same, 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 same. I know we've never been drunk, but I know I've been tipsy once. And then I fell asleep. Alright, I'm going to apologize because... I think we got a delivery coming right now, and I think my dog's gonna bark like crazy because they'll come down our driveway. I might have to mute here in just one sec. I'm hoping he's asleep enough behind me to where he does not see what's going on outside his window. Oh, hi. Oh no, they're giving up on Hook! 
right, I will be right back. Alright, I'm back. Sorry about that. I told you! We had a delivery, so Pope was very upset. And then I had to get up and stop him. My bad! I'm sorry, team! There was a Pope emergency! Please don't grab me! Please don't grab me! Please don't grab me! Damn it. Sorry! I'm sorry! Aha, Poppy emergency! Don't save me, I don't deserve. I don't deserve to be in this match. I had to leave for a bit. But I also apologize to everybody. I did have to leave for one second to close the window because we had a delivery and Taser does not like that. He does not like when people are in his in his yard. I'll get all my points though here. All right, all right, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It doesn't happen often. It doesn't happen often, but I had to move, leave. Oh, let me put the music on. I think I need to fix my VTuber as well because I got up. Um, was anybody? I bet you everyone was mad. I bet you everyone was mad because of that. It was not a good match. I love camping killers. Can't! Can't judge! Can't judge! I wasn't here! I'm sorry! I won't judge the demo. I tried to book it for the Steve, though, and get him off with my speed, and I couldn't. I could get him off the hook with my speed. All right, we can't, I was going to end stream there, but I can't end the day on that. So we're going to play another match. Um, let's see what do we want to put in. We got to end our day on a good, on a good note. Is that the freaking in my earphones? Oh, I'm like, what the hell is the emergency alert system? <laughs> I think it's in the song that's going on. I don't like that. Um, I don't want Sabo. Alright, alright, let's get back in the groove here. What the hell is this song? No, down thumbs this. No, no. No. I don't like when people put the emergency alert system in music. <laughs> Escape through a hatch. 
match, which we haven't got today other than that one match when I didn't have it active. That was me just a second ago. That emote. I heard that. And I was like, what the hell? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? There's something bad. And I even took my earphone off to see what, it, or my headphone, to see what it was. And it was in my song. So, nope. Hey, GG's, you were the demo. Well, GG's to you as well. I'm so sorry. I didn't. I, I was AFK for a couple minutes in the match. So I apologize. I was absolutely a trash, trash survivor. You did well from what I could tell. I'm so sorry. I had to go AFK for a minute. My, we got a delivery and my dog is in our, my room and he was freaking out because he hates people in his space. So I had to hop in a locker real quick and I was there for a good couple minutes. But you did good. I, I, I can't judge too much, but you did awesome. You did as awesome as I could tell, and I apologize again. No, you are really good. Well, thank you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't normally have to AFK for a minute. And that's why I went for the Steve, um, like, the way I did. I'm just like, I gotta get to Steve really quick! And I had, um, resilience. So I was hoping to get him off the hook before you noticed. And I didn't, which is okay. It happens. It's all good. Abby, thank you so much for the follow, and welcome on into Skelly Town. I hope you keep up the good work. I don't- somebody said something in in-game chat, and I just left, because I don't- I saw nothing. I saw nothing. I thought you played a great game. I thought you played a great game from what I could tell, so I can't say nothing bad about anything. Other than I was absolute trash, because I didn't do much. So many leases today? There has been. There has been. This is like what the third or fourth one we've gotten. I don't I see honestly I don't see Cheryl as much. I've seen her a few times today as well. Sybil's absolutely I don't want to say non-existent. She's here and there, but Lisa's probably the most popular I've seen. Good luck. At least today. It could be Pinhead. No, not Pinhead, excuse me, Pyramid Head. I always say Pinhead for Pyramid Head. You don't usually see many of them? You don't, no. I will, uh, okay. <laughs> I don't think you realize I went back to the Jed. But I know I've seen a couple Lisas today, no Sybils, but she's very rare. And I think I saw Cheryl earlier? If I'm not mistaken, it might have been I'm somebody else I was watching, because I was watching some DVD before I started. Blossom! Hello! Thank you so much for the lurk! I hope you're having a lovely day. I hope you're feeling better today. Ooh, cage where? Where, where? Near. The Lisa DC'd. She got caught, was put in a cage, and she said, No thank you, I'm out. Jen down here. Ah, oops. Oh, I'm not feeling better, but I had to work both jobs today. No, I'm so sorry, Blossom. I'm sorry you're not feeling better. I'm sorry I had to work both jobs too. Well, I hope you're good. Home. Are, are you home now? Hi, Lori. <laughs> if not, I hope you can go home soon and get lots of rest. I'll survive. Could be worse, exactly. 
You sounded like you were okay yesterday, but it did sound like you were having a little bit of issues at times, which I know, I know. I've had sicknesses where it's like, I feel pretty good, but definitely could be way worse. You're not home yet? Oh no! I hope you get home soon. I hope you get lots of rest. You need it. She wants heals, so I'm gonna leave her be. I'm gonna go find a gen. No clue where everybody's been since he finally caught. Well, they caught the one girl and then she DC'd. I don't know if he's in the house or not. He is now. This gen. Let me get rid of this toolbox. Yes, all the good vibes. Yes, for everybody. Those who, because everyone, there's been a couple people today who aren't feeling well, who are struggling. It's kind of been a theme today, which is always sad. I hate to hear it. Just remember, if you're feeling sick, we're always here. If you need someone to talk to, we're always here. If you need to be left alone, we're always here to leave you alone as well. <laughs> Just always remember, you come first. If you need to sit back, relax, it's all good. finishing or him catching that one person I don't really know what's been going on this is not a good spot for head on but I don't even know if he'll come in here nope Oh no, did he open the door or did someone finally get it open? Frick, it stepped in the goo. Hi! <laughs> I didn't even see that goo there! Just I had to step in it and then I knew I had the- I knew I had the clear once he hit me. Because I had the speed burst. Well, we didn't get to escape on hatch. <gasps> that one, that TTV. I thought they played well. I thought they played well. I'm so sorry that that Lisa DC'd right after they got caught. TTV, odd or not. That's a cute name. I thought they played well. I knew I had the clear, though. Once they saw them, I could go for it. I guess uh, one of the people opened the door. I don't know who it was. But Lori, I guess, opened the door. Brutal strength and Dory pop trails of torments. Well, I am going to probably call it there because that was a pretty good way to end the stream. And um, it's 6.30, so we had some fun today in the fog. 
I love being here despite feeling the need to be alone. Well, I'm glad that you still love to be here because I know that feeling. I know that feeling where you just want to be left alone, but sometimes hanging out in chats, it does make you either feel better or or whatever it may be. I'm glad that you feel safe and you love being here. I love having you here. But again, if you do want to be alone, I completely understand. I'm, I was the same way this past Friday and a little bit on Saturday. Just kind of like wanted to be in my bubble and just kind of, you know, hang out by myself. But it is what it is. You, if you need to take care of yourself, I completely understand. Usually those are the times I really dig myself deep into my own head. Mm-hmm. Same. I know. And that's why sometimes, like, when I start to get in my own head like that, I will try to, like, even though I want to spend time alone and just, like, be in my own bubble, I try to go into, like, my friends' chats and stuff, if they are live, or even just immersing myself in somebody's chat who's, like, a big time, like, we'll say, partner streamer with millions of people talking, just, like, watching them play my favorite game sometimes will help me get out of my own head. I don't talk, because it's, like, a moving chat, and I don't know if they even see me, but it still will help me, and so... I understand, but I know, I know it can be rough, and I hope you start feeling so much better, Denny. You are amazing, and I hope that tomorrow you feel even better, and I thank you so much for hanging out with me. I love hanging out with you. You guys are so amazing. Have a great rest of the evening. Thank you. I will, and everybody else, if you are not feeling well in any shape or form, I hope you all get better, whether it's sick with, like, a cold, sick with the disease, sick just not feeling well in general i hope you all feel better soon just know my discord is always open if you want to talk my dms are always open if you want to talk if you just want to be left alone you can also dm me and say leave me the hell alone i will do that <laughs> so i totally totally get it but i do appreciate y'all hanging out with me i had an absolute blast today in the fog and we got up to what do we do we got up to silver two which is not too bad, not too bad. We only escaped through hatch once, and I didn't have that active. And then we got up to silver four. I think we were at silver four as killer. We didn't have a very successful day as killer. It, it was not a very successful day as killer, but we had fun. That's all that matters. Always remember, as long as you have fun. You know, the game can be frustrating sometimes. It's a thing, but if you have fun, it's all Gouda. You're very welcome and love you too, Blossom. I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful evening. Let me go see who we want to raid. First, I'm going to see if that person we just played against is live. I think this is how you spell their name. They are not live, so we are not going to go raid them. Let me see if this person is live. That's me. I have an ad. We played against this person earlier as well, so I want to see if we want to go right over here. Thank you guys so much for posting the raid commands and also giving Blossom a shout out. I think we're going to go check out this person. Sorry, let me get a let me get my raid set up if I'm quiet. I'm just listening to make sure. It is somewhere I do want to send our community, but they seem friendly. They were an amazing survivor. And they absolutely kicked my ass as as I was playing the Legion. So we're gonna go give Devour some love from Skellytown. They were in our chat earlier. We also played a match against them when we were Legion. They were the Fang. They're still playing Fang. It sounds like they're playing with friends as well. So we're going to go meet them and say hello and say thank you for kicking our ass in our game. <laughs> like I said, it was a fun match nonetheless, so I have nothing wrong with it. But I'm going to go send all the love to them. If you guys would like to join the raid and meet some new friends, you are more than welcome to spread all the love from Scaly Town as well. If you are sub to the channel, let me copy this. If you are sub to the channel, you can copy paste the second raid command. If you are not, you may copy paste the first one if you want. And it shows the same amount of love and everything. But again... Everybody, I hope you feel better. Take time for yourself if you need. Again, my DMs are always open. If you're just feeling sick, I hope you feel better. Get all the sleep and rest you need. I will be back on Wednesday with more Dead by Daylight. Maybe we'll sneak in some Disney, but I didn't feel the need to, to play it today. So who knows? We might not play it on Wednesday either. We will definitely be playing Dead by Daylight, though. So thank you again, guys, for hanging out. 
I had a blast today. I hope you all have a lovely start to the rest of your week. And I shall see you guys on Wednesday. Thank you again, and bye bye